Call of Duty, and I'm going to tell you a story about a guy who went 10 0. <laughs> Once upon a time, actually, we're not going to do this. I'm going to have you roll up a new uh, Pathfinder character, and I'm going to judge you along the whole way. All right, human, very original. <laughs> I, I love that. All right, human. All right. All right. Where'd you going to be? Oh, you, you scratched out human because I said that, huh? Mm. All right. Mm, don't like S that. Subject doesn't like it when I make fun of their ancestry choice. Interesting. <laughs> All right, let's see what they've got now. He's scrolling, to the, oh, he's scrolling oh, to the rare section. Ooh, he wants to play ooh, as the spiders. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, he's going to play as the spiders. Ooh. Do you know how to play the spiders? Do you know how to play the you spiders? You don't? No, of idiot. Course you don't. Stupid, dumbass. Of course you don't. <laughs> you just start fucking here and like, you, yeah, you don't. I love don't the idea you? that like it... it I think my favorite part about that was it starts really quiet and then like he slowly gets more and more mad. Like, really mad. Oh, human, I see. Okay. Oh, spiders. Oh, fucking spiders. I still haven't played Pathfinder 2E yet. There, there is. I, I forget here. Fucking... I know. I know because I what well, I was going to make a Pathfinder character with you and I like looked at all the races yeah. and there was like a spider race. Yeah. But I was going to be a goblin ultimately. To to complete the uh to complete the joke. Uh let's see. Oh, goblin alchemist joined the legion, hey. Oh, I see. In the shade of the magic clay down in Dingley fucking Dell. Oh yeah, so it's a naughty. That's who they are. They're sapient spiders that can like that like have a humanoid form. Pathfinder's fucking weird these days. I actually play Pathfinder today, fun fact. Oh. Uh, multiplayer. Join game. Gore gore. Um, I still have yet to play Pathfinder 2E. <laughs> uh, I, I like it quite a bit. Uh, so much so that I'm on their fucking subscription service and uh, get books in the mail semi-frequently. I um, my friend, some of my friends and I are going to be starting up a. Well, two actually, I'm I'm running two campaigns actually, written, starting soon. Right. Uh, one is masks. Running a masks campaign, um, and the other is uh, uh, the Star Wars uh, Edge of the Empire. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, they really love that one. That I mean, to be fair, that one is really good if you if you if you have the right crowd that like really cares for the like the storytelling aspect. Right. Yeah. Um, but like there, the, we were. I was talking. I was talking about some stuff. I was like, okay, what's allowed and what's not allowed. Like, I one thing I don't allow is like you can't play anyone who can use the force. That's right. like that shit's like game breaking if you really know force characters. Yeah. Um, uh, which I was, which when I was playing a, a Clone Wars era Jedi Master, uh, last campaign I was in, um, I didn't abuse it, but I looked at I looked at all the stuff, and the game master was like, "Yeah, take 500 XP to spend on like just force powers alone." And I was like, "500 XP?" Yeah, you were like, you were like, you what? So like, this my Jedi master could bring people back from the dead. Oh, good. Um, and also another thing, battle meditations. So I just like rolled like super high on like the force powers. And like everyone around me just got like, oh yeah, six automatic successes on all my rolls on top of whatever I already rolled. Cool. <laughs> so so I'm like, hey hey, um, I'm gonna dumb myself down a bit. And I'm gonna take away 200 XP worth of like force powers. Mm. I know I'm supposed to be the Jedi Master, but like, <laughs> all right, let's see, where were we? Huh. Oh, that's right. I had, I made Prince Adam, and now he's blue. Oh right, I uh, I completely forgot who this guy is. is Eerie Kane wife, because <laughs> we, I forgot about this whole party actually. I, I remember Jimothy the Q, Daniel. Like, how could you forget that? Okay, you forget Jimothy the Q. I, why is his name Jimothy the Q? It's funny. Thirty-three-year-old bloodhorn warrior. 
And Eerie is still only like level one. Alright, so we got some places to go. There's a recruit opportunity here. Yeah, right. I could do some like scouting with Jimothy. So or, or we can pick one one of both of us so somebody's not left out of the combat. So here's an idea. I was thinking we could gather here at uh, Kralbane Fount. Uh huh. Um, one of us goes to recruit here. Right. And then, like the rest of us, go to scout and fight at the other these neighboring places. Yeah. All that happens. I would like Does to be good? able to. Yeah, that sounds good. I was gonna say I was. I would like to be able to uh, connect like Brandbane Lumberyard to all this shit. Yeah, we can do that. Um, so, who's going to recruit the person over here? Um, I almost want to say Jimothy. Yeah, it works for me. Only because he's, like, leveled up so fast compared to the rest of us. He's, like, supposed to be, like... He's the new guy. The, he's, the, he's the new guy, but he's not. Uh, and then we want to scout Hard Fox Plains. Yeah, or... we could do we could do Hard Fox because there's definitely going to be a fight there. All beca also because his name it's called Hard Fox. And yeah, you know us, Eerie and Darl. Okay. <laughs> okay. When in search of an exile. Oh, where did it go? It disappeared for me. Uh, how do we fuck with that? Um, do we need to? Oh, it's a it, click on Eerie. Oh, there it, it's an Eerie hook. Oh, well, okay. I started it. <coughs> Darloff never told anyone. In fact, he often wondered whether he had tr it truly happy to have it all. I can't remember what I gave Darloff as, hoof, uh, as hooks. Death curse had been laid upon his head as a boy the word of some weird witch whose wrath had been stirred. A vulture voice shrieked in Darloff's sleep, returning each year upon the night of a shadowed moon. Holy fuck, he man. Yeah. Many years went by as falls <laughs> piled upon Darloff and began to feel a flushing hand at his heart. Death might come at any night now, it seems. So at last he confided in someone. He chose a friend. A woman with it, he'd fought battles and beaten dire odds. Guys, it's just up this way. She's pissed. I'm, you know, I'm surprised. I'm trying to get these two to fall in love, actually. Oh, yeah? Because I want to see what the fuck would happen if he had a kid with blue skin. Oh, yeah. <laughs> would it? Would the blue skin pass down, or is that that's just a, him? That's a good question. We, we need to find out. Because, like, uh. like, Jay's thunder feed didn't pass down. No. Traveled the whispered uh, home of exile, an old mystic repu uh, reputed to have uh, studied curses in their encounters. I do wonder what. Well, there's a reason exiles got exiled, right? Because other folks are scared of them. That means they must have been capable of something others th that others aren't. You know, like watch Castlevania for fuck's sake, Belmonts. Yeah, they. <laughs> <laughs> they know how to read. <laughs> That's why they got exiled. <laughs> they read. What's her name? Uh, the one I heard was Dries. Hello? <laughs> Hello, I heard my name. Shadow fawn, my uh, night things, moonwalkers, and lostlings, if you creep hungry to my cottage door away again, I'm no morsel for a tooth nor treasure for... Oh. Someone shines a light on, on their faces. Two Kuth travelers! Ahoo! Ahoo! Come inside! It's late! I've got eggs! But I've got <laughs> eggs! But I've got eggs! This is Exile Mystic about Darloff's curse as she fried eggs in a brew. What is this hook? Wait. Let me see Darloff here. What did I give you? Yeah, what did you give Darloff? Hook, loyal, flirt, physical. Uh... Is this, is this a Darloff hook? Wait, let's. No wait. Or is this, this is a, this is eerie. I think this is an eerie hook. Because I had to click Crowd on eerie. Crowd physical first. brash. Okay. What? This sounds like. This sounds like not that. <laughs> Any of those. They tell us this exiled mystic about Darla's curse: fried eggs, salt, herbs. Curses, hexes are all 
really extensions of nature, agents of wild will, like beasts, like fire, eating, breathing, and destroying. Once a curse is spun into motion, it follows the curse of chaos. The trick is to trap it, to lure it out of the life of its circles, and bind it within a prison. Sure, I know how to do this, but the cost is always steep. We can just get about anything we want. What will it take? X. This, there's some way you must go. I mean, might as well, right? Hmm. Let's see. I mean, we did. I mean, Darlos feels like he's been cursed, right? Right, yeah. Um. Let me see. I mean, you might as well follow through with it, right? Do you think so? I think so. I think. Um. I don't know. Does it feel weird to you? Um. I mean, like, yeah, but like, also, Jay felt weird being just like, "This is my intestines." <laughs> I, I suppose so. So. Yeah, might as well. Might as well. I just don't want. Uh, I don't want. Oh uh, yeah, Kay just doesn't get to come with. Oh, I get it. Oh. Oh. Wait, I think did we just take Cadus actually? Mm -mm. You're, you're traveling with Cadus, but Cadus isn't showing up on the selected heroes list. Oh. Well, because uh, it has to be Eerie and it has to be Darloff. It has to be Eerie and Darloff. I mean, we could take Cadus. Uh, I don't know. I think maybe splitting into two groups of two wouldn't be too bad. You want Cadus to go with uh, Jimothy? Yeah, we can have Cadus help Jimothy for now, and then when we get a third... Uh... Alright, so we'll go to Recruit here, and then it'll be Cadus and Jimothy. Okay. Yeah. Because I don't want Jimothy... I don't want Cadus going recruiting on his... Look at this guy. How old is he? <laughs> it's Jamal. We okay. can also pick from Legacy. Uh, who do we get in this? Oh, dude, it's Orin! Oh my god, Orin shows up? I don't know. That's up to you, though. That's up to you. I, Orin was kind of, Orin kind of fucked. Yeah. Uh, okay. So so here's where I'm at. I feel like if we put Orin in the game, he's just gonna carry everything. Um, <laughs> and I I do want to see more of the boys, but I but I also wanna I, I want to go through like one more campaign without like that much legacy characters, and then we can start really really start really fucking, breaking in old legacies. Yeah, okay, I we get can it. we can get fucking psychotic with it. Okay, so let's make this guy. So what class is he going to be? Oh my god, is he holding a club? Look at that. Holy shit. <laughs> he's 19, by the way. He's nice. 19, and he's got this full-ass <laughs> goatee. He's got a full-ass goatee. Um, okay. Um, are, are we going to like create this character from scratch? Uh, it's going to be from scratch, yes. Okay, 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 okay. So are we going to make a warrior, are we going to make a hunter, or are we going to make a mystic? We got two warriors already. I think I think first and foremost, I think we need another another female because we're kind of we're kind of left for deading yeah, on it's kind uh, of it's, it's kind of a sausage party, isn't it? Uh, I was going to we say go. we're kind of left for deading on uh, on the dude to chick ratio here. Yeah. Um all right, gender female. Body type feminine. Voice feminine B. Feminine Attracted B. to anyone. Sure, we can do that. <laughs> sure, I'll allow them to be bi. Why not? You're bi. You're bi. All right, head face. Uh, let's see. Let's get rid of the beard, for God's sake. Get rid of the facial hair. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna fuck with history, uh, history and stats while you're doing that. Do the the physical appearance. Okay, I'm going down the list here. Uh, brash, broken heart, clown, creative, curious, dark heart. Destiny, distant, dreamer, flirt, gritty, inhabited, integrity, literary, loyal, lucky, mysterious, nostalgic, physical, potential, proud, shame, slacker, thorny, wanderlust, weird, and wild heart. What if we did like... 
What does inhabited mean? R I don't know, Reggie. Uh, what if we do like inhabited, wild heart, and er. You want like broken heart, you want like thorny. We haven't done like a broken heart one, haven't we? No, I don't have think we? I don't think we've ever done that I'm, one. I'm not guaranteed that that's gonna proc, but like that's, no, that's it's a thing. thing. Oh, we'll do it. Um and then stats. Uh personality stats. Poet, loner, romantic, hothead, bookish, coward, leader, snark, greedy, goofball, healer. Um, dark heart being a thing. Maybe we, maybe we do like loner. Maybe we do like loner, hothead, snark for the top three. Loner, hot, hot, snark. Okay. This person's like the Sasuke. Like Crawford? I don't know. I I, I I called Crawford the Sasuke, but I think he was way too goofy to to, to be a Sasuke. Right? I think like I think he just ended up ironically being like a uh, like Sas like he ended up ironically being a Sasuke, but like sure. Their color is like a redhead. Be a redhead, and not just like any redhead, like aggressively redhead. <laughs> aggressively redhead. Like, look in the general hemisphere that this chick is in, and then you get fucking blinded. Like, if you're like, if you go into like, if if you're like talking about someone in your class, like, like, do you know like so and so? Who? The redhead. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, and what's her name? What's her name? Um, the randomizer or something for we, we have a randomizer. We've got who need you melon right now for the name. Who need you melon? Okay. Keep melon as the last name. That's, that's some like Ivana tinkle shit. <laughs> who need you melon? Who need you melon? Here, we can keep Melon. I'm going to hit randomize a couple times. Okay. Grim Grimrin West. Ellen Light. Freya Guster. James Drutt Overcott. Thisty. I thought it said thirsty for a moment. <laughs> Rowana Qualen. Sonvir Ramsey. Lonuna Prophet. Jane. We could keep that one. <laughs> I kind of like Jane and then in the. Okay. Ellen oh. Swine. <laughs> okay, okay, we kind of have to have Ellen Swine. <laughs> so what were we keeping? Let's keep Ellen Swine. <laughs> just, just, just Ellen Swine. Yeah. Alright. Alright. I'm good with that. Alright, hell yeah. Recruit. Oh, where are we making her? Oh, uh, God. Uh, we could do... I, I feel maybe like another wizard. Visa. Yeah, let's do another mystic. Let's do another mystic. <laughs> Your adventures, right? So you've, been, so, so you've seen things. Timothy's like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Sometimes things I wish we hadn't. Have you ever met people who have a second soul? What? Sometimes I come through for, for a moment reflecting on the angle of some light. What? And then they say, what the fuck? And then they say things they don't remember or suddenly have skills they never learned. Ask you for a friend. Right. If you could change your fate. If you could you? change your fate. It wouldn't surprise me, but uh, very little does anymore. You're like... How old are you, Jimothy? Hold the fuck on. You're like yeah, you talking went, like you're an old man. You went on half an adventure. You're 34. Like, calm down. 
It's weird as all, and I thought uh, I thought that maybe if I could join you, I could get the bottom of whatever it is for my friend. I can't guarantee answers, but the Fellowship of the Silent Song can always use more fighters. I'm gonna get a Mystic. Yeah, I think so. She looks good as a Mystic. One one of these one of these days we need to do one just like all warriors or all hunters or some shit. <laughs> Just exclusively like granola crunching fucking hunters. Oh boy. Other uh, than uh, Darloth and Jimothy are. Wait, am I bringing Jimothy over here? Wait, no, no, no I'm not. No. It's Eerie and Darloth over here. And then they're training. What? Why, why is what? that not happening? Oh, because apparently Jimothy was supposed to be part of that party. Oh, yeah. I just took Jimothy out of the party, and now it's fine. An earthy pit awaits them. I'm not set on going through with this. I want you to know that it's fine to turn back. I've already come this far. Let's see what we find. They make their way down through the dark. I'm not saying we're being idiots, but do we have any reason to take that exile at her word? God, he's like a racist. <sighs> That damned exile. <laughs> I mean, she seemed to know what she was talking about, which I guess is admittedly strange. Exactly! Where is some topic to be an ex expert in, isn't it? Kramer. Oh my god, can we make like the Seinfeld crew? Oh, in, like, that would one be great. Campaign? I would love that, yeah. We get Jerry, we Kramer, Elaine, George, Newman, Uncle Leo. <laughs> I love it. We that, That's what the next one is. No, well, okay, yeah, that's what the next one is. But that that's what one is going to be. I don't know about the next one, but that's we'll true. Anyway, look, half broken wall here and a chamber on the other side of it. They're able to duck and slide through a jagged crack in the ancient stonework. It was meant to be sealed, I guess. Crumble still more as they scrape by. How many generations ago? Mortar comes away like cake paste. On the other side. <laughs> they won't let it's... you see his cock. <laughs> How well endowed he is! <laughs> Look at the size of that thing. It looks like. She said it was buried. I don't think she meant buried. He reads, Everlasting Rest Now cradles our bright hero, Ansel Artalis, who tore our world from the towns of a hungry evil and gave its life up to free from, hung from tyranny. He looks 12. Shut up. <laughs> so this jewel of it to find it has to be buried with his bones. Oh, so we have to determine if we actually want to dig up this guy's bones or Huh, okay. See see now this is the point where I think something something's afoot, right? Somebody just goes, Oh yeah, could you go to this ancient hero's grave and dig up this cool thing he found? Mm. I don't know. I love, I love that in this, this case is, it's eerie. That's like, you know what? No, this, I'm, I'm done here. But Darloff is like, yeah, grave robbing. Let's go. I don't like it. I don't like it. If I got a curse on Darloff, Darloff can handle it. Look at him. He's blue. He's blue. wrong the, it's the fucking exile intent on getting answers if things go sideways trees are back battled elements to reach that cavern. And you found it all right? We lost our way once or twice. Well, as to that, I mean the jewel. You sent us to desecrate a tomb. You didn't get it. And I told you the price Wait, of Wait, you got like a dialogue or something? Yeah, like they're talking to me right now. Oh, I just fucking killed her. Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> I just got like a fucking, I just got like a whole ass, pro I just got a whole ass battle. 
I, mean, I didn't get any. I didn't get any commentary or anything. She like says. That. I just gotta... She says. Well, I need the the Dwemel during uh, prison that contains my immortal soul. Oh, that does sound fairly unique. Yeah, I know your voice. You're the woman who cursed me. <laughs> okay. Your oh, voice. oh, I how convenient! You. I hear you in the night, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> Eerie is very unimpressed. They they're having a stare down. Yes, yeah, fine, all right, that was me. You may as well know it all. At this point my name isn't Trees. Why would it be? No, call me Volta of Grey Mountain. For I am the Vulture Queen herself. In the charted sun raw days before that wait, you're getting this, right? You understand what I'm doing? You're explaining the thing. All right, perfect. So in the charred and sun-raw days before the rise of tree talkers, the star watchers, or the wave-wandering poets, in those scorched and beautiful days, I was Volta of Grey Mountain, who conquered all the lands and peoples within my span. My soldiers were strong and plentiful as the... You're still going! I stooped over every town, farm, and tower, plucked every gob gobbet of joy that pleased me, and my reign would have lasted forever if not for a certain acne-scarred thing. A guy is what he was. A guy is what he was. Ansel... I'm not saying his last name. His awful and cumbersome name. <laughs> Disguised, he came to me with a beautiful jewel, lied to me, and as I looked upon the gem, he spoke a rhyme. My immortal soul poured from me. My essence was imprisoned within the jewel for eternity, leaving my body. This shell you see before you, powerless but alive. Over millennia I've roved. Then, well, then what's the deal? Like, you don't care about your immortal soul because you're still here. For untold stretches of time, I was so weak that I could barely eat, but I did hunger. Hunger was all I had. But you found the strength to curse me? Oh, y yeah. Around the time you were a child, Darloff, a mighty quake split the earth. The sealed chamber where uh, Aristalis was buried with my powers must have broken. This By the way, I just killed her. Yeah. This Quite allowed some of my strength to, to seep back to me. Unfortunately, the hollowed tomb still repelled my gaze, my steps, my efforts to attack it. The words of the spell demanded the hands of somebody with good intentions. Such a person was able to remove the jewel. Ingeniously, then, I laid a curse on a child, one destined to be a hero, one capable of seeking out and exhuming the jewel. Once retrieved, I would bind the curse into the gem and place on my own soul, freeing me etern eternally and at last. So the nature of my curse is, oh, it'll kill you, unless the body of mine, or unless this body of mine dies first. And then everyone kind of looks at each other. Oh well, guess I'll have to start over. And then the both of you drew your weapons. Wait, did we get DC? Uh, did we? Oh no, I'm so watching. Some... I'm watching your battle play out now. Yeah, because it's literally just her. Good job, Colin. You did it like five minutes ago. Did you get the thing that happened afterwards? Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, who? I'll just. I'll just yeah, I'll just skip over. It's fine. Uh, Eerie Kane wife is now a Bluehorn Mystic. Yay! And I gave and I gave Eerie Kane wife uh, inspiration as a level up thing. So if you're adjacent to her, you get plus one damage. Nice. Uh, what's her level up thing? Elementalist, uh, indignance. I do like indignance. Uh, Mythweaver though. Yeah, we could uh, indignance now that it's two damage is pretty solid. On Jay, it wasn't as good. Because it was just... We'll give indignance to her, then. Alright, so that's... So that's two levels for... Eerie. That's actually kind of a good catch-up, because she was kind of behind. Yeah. Um... Do, you want, do we want Darloff and Eerie to... You, scout the you, sleeping gashes forest? Let's do sleeping gashes. I think it's supposed to be sleeping... Get sleep out of here, Timothy! I think it's supposed to be sleeping ashes, but... You're probably right. <laughs> Recruit prepared! Alright, what's she getting? <laughs> wow, Wait, she's least... like wide. <laughs> I forgot I gave her like max wideness and it's kind of short. Um. Kimper says GTFO tomorrow. Tonight, tonight probably too late. Um. That's up to you. That one's up to you. I'll do Spirit Blade. When people did you hear me about? Did you hear me about GTFO? Yeah, we can do GTO, GTFO tomorrow. I might be like wrecked because I'm getting my I'm getting my booster tomorrow. 
That's okay. I, I'm gonna be doing a lot of homework tomorrow too, so. Did I tell you I have COVID? Uh, yeah, I, I remember that. I can't remember if I told you I have COVID or not. Um, oh wait, fuck. Tomorrow's Gipper wants to. Uh, tomorrow's F wants to do Sonic though too. Dude, you know I, I was counting the games. We're almost done with Sonic. Oh yeah. I was kind of counting. It's like okay, Sonic Colors. Like okay, we got plenty of games still to go. And I'm like counting. I'm like, whoa, there's actually not a lot of Sonic games left. There's like Sonic Generations, Sonic Colors, and then like Sonic Forces and Sonic Mania, and then Sonic like Team Racing. That's about like it. Uh, I was like, oh, let's assault the workshop. You know, fight them with Ellen Swine. I forgot her name is Ellen Swine. Oh, uh, what would you do, Jimothy, if you found your heart racing at the thought of another? Somebody you stood beside through danger and then? It's interesting. I suppose. Probably I'd, fuck them. I'd probably fuck them. Asking them, I mean, <laughs> as long as I thought it wouldn't destroy the group. Stop that mumbling. There's a sound. Hushed voices and careful footfalls approach down the overgrown <laughs> path. <laughs> I'd probably well, fuck them. Well, I'd probably fuck them, I guess, first and foremost. Even these muffled noises are perfectly loud. Come forward, strangers. If you're friendly, come forward slowly. Silence. Perhaps a minute of it, a minute of it is all the answer that emerges from a thick wall of brush. Then, Gail, you idiot. They're not fooled by this. We're prolonging the inevitable. Yes, mistress. I don't like that. Uh, should I offer myself? Introduce us. Yes, master. Yeah. We can hear your... Oh, there. Oh? I told you not to call me that. You look like experienced whatever you are. Bandits? Rogues? Not hunting for captives, I hope. I went out there. You're caught anyway. Ah, uh, well. Oh, move it, you fool. How are you so miserable at this? Sorry, mistress. Here, take my arm. A pair of travelers clamors for you. Oh, I've them. had this event before. This one's nice. I'm Gale, servant and apprentice to this prestigious and lovely woman who... Uh, well, perhaps we shouldn't use your real name. That's... <laughs> that's Luelle? Luel. Luel. <laughs> Oops, he uh he knows your name. And why wouldn't he? Luel the dream chanter, poet and peerless singer. Impossible to turn away an ear when she's plucking strings, spinning yarns, and deploying her famous vowels. Oh, 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 her and her mighty vowels. Well, you don't seem like a threat. Come sit by the fire. We're not in any kind of bad business. By the fire sounds grand. Jimothy. Jim Jimothy. J oh, Jimmy, old pal. The small camp settles a little awkwardly. Introductions go around shortly after. Cadus can't help himself. He, he bends Luel's ear. Our reality is indivisible <laughs> from our mythology. You can't just open with that, Cadus. That's a quote from uh, Melodine, I'm sure, as you know. You really cemented the truth of it for me, though. See... You sang Queen of the Seas. Oh! <laughs> oh, you're a big fucking nerd. Because like, your character's bookish that she act that he ac I've never actually seen this one before. Your character's bookish, so she so he's actually read on this character. Huh. Y you sang Queen of the Seas in uh, Grand Johnstead. I wept. I heard about your rendition of w Wadshan, spoken for an audience of craftspeople. Not a dry eye, they said. Yes, I remember those days. I try not to miss them. Oh, mistress, you don't need to say it. I do, though. It's just that nothing lasts forever. Bad fever took my lofty registers from me. My volume. Performance is such a physical thing. Most forget that. I'm weak nowadays. I lean on him, my student Gale there. I would love to show that gift to you again, but it's gone now. Only the memory remains. Why not try a small song? Even if it's quiet, even if it's just a shout of you, we'd like it. You know, let the bard sing one more song, or let the student give a try. <laughs> he looks so concerned in the other picture. What the fuck? 71% chance. 71% chance? I, I, I know the outcome of both, so it's up to you. 71% chance is pretty good. Uh, although we have missed attacks that are at 71%. Um... Uh, I think, 
I think I'm gonna go with Apprentice. Okay. We 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 have a new generation of Bards, right? Okay. Am I supportive of a teacher that you're ashamed to show what you learned? Well, I... No, mistress, of course not. So? Young Gale, apprentice to Luel, the dream chanter, removes his instrument from its case, his features composed, to take on a startling dignity. Uh, uh. He sings and plays with great skill, a testament to the talents of his mentor. First, he performs a somber ballad. Next, a rousing and farcical tune to turn dour lips up. Smiles pool in the warm orange wash of firelight and song. He plays well in the night until others begin to pitch in with stories or songs. The night before the fight, the fight at Duckvale work, Duckvale Workshop passes easily. Ducks, in good duck, company. Duck, ducks, ducks. So what the other? So if you went to a seventy-one percent chance, um, if you succeeded, you would have given the enemy like minus one attack and minus two health. Ah, uh, nice. Um, if you if the if the chance would have failed, nothing would have happened. It would have been the same outcome as picking the. The, the the apprentice, which meant like there's no duff, buffs or debuffs given out. I forget. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So there, <laughs> that's what would have happened. All right, interviews. Uh, what's what do we have here? I guess I'll let you take control of her since I have control of everything else. You got control of Jimothy and Cadis, so I'll take I'll take her. Yeah. Um. We'll go with that. Spirit Blade. I tried to left click on the enemy to get some more information, but uh, left click also does attacks and shit, so. Oh, uh, yeah. Um. Cadis is controlled by blue. Cadis already did his thing. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there you go. Wait. In turn. Okay, I can manually just force them to go. Fire belch. Okay, you know what? That's actually okay. We're we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. I thought I shredded your armor. Oh wait, I did. I just wasn't paying attention. Ooh. If you move that blaze somewhere else, I can definitely kill uh, the building. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, interesting. Wait, wait, wait. How do I do that? Do what? I can apparently grant you a burning as a free burning arrow as a free action. Oh. Um, oh, it has to be next to you. That's probably what it is. I mean, I can Okay. I was going to say I could just move him. Or you could do it to uh, Jimothy. Uh Jimothy's kind of a strong boy. I'm trying to. It's not letting me. I, I'm going to assume that it's just a little bugged right now.
Interesting. Okay. That's weird. Alright. It's just not letting me do it. <laughs> Alright. Isn't exactly the best spot for him to be in, but I'm gonna do it. Oh, ouch. nice! Yeah, you hate to see that 80% do that. All right, well, uh, that's fine too. There you go. Oh, Jimothy wins the Super Bowl! Jimothy! Dude. Nothing here. You have to open that gate, probably. Yeah. Can he open the door without revealing himself? Uh, if he's, uh, silk stepped, yeah. Oh, it's just a skeptic. Or sept spectic. Spectic. What's wrong, Inspector? You look septic. What's wrong, Inspector? You look septic. I don't know what septic means, but something stinks. I've got a nose. I watched that one 3D, uh, movie of... Lupin the Third, by the way. Oh yeah, I, I, I quite liked it. Even the it, it the, actually was pretty good. I, that was uh, my first ever like Lupin the Third anything. Yeah, I actually I, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I do want to do Lupin shit. Uh, I, I want to watch like more Lupin shit uh, with with some pals. Yeah, I'm, I'd be down. I'm gonna put him behind this table because because I like um what's his name the guy with the, the guy with the hat. Oh, um... Uh, it starts with a K, doesn't it? Mm. <laughs> God, I, I can't believe I can't remember his fucking name. I've watched... You know who I'm open. talking about, though, yeah, right? Yeah, you know yeah. I mean, you're not guy talking... Who's a, guy, guy who's voiced by Bobo Bo in, like, fucking... Yeah, I mean, you're, you're not talking about Zenigata, who also usually has a hat. The detective. No, I'm, talking about, I'm, not, I'm not talking, talking about, about the, the gun guy. Though. Yeah, I'm talking about the gun guy with Lupin. Uh, what is his fucking name? Oh uh, my god! Daisuke Jigen. Oh, okay. Ha, huh, I'm sure that's a big turn on for a guy like you, Jigen. Uh, Guardian. <laughs> I was like, I'm glad Lupin could just pull off being pretend Hitler. Yeah. <laughs> Spoilers for anyone who haven't seen it, but like, then again, you at this point, you probably don't care. Or don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah. There was a watchman here the whole time? Uh-huh. And a welding. And a welding? What the fuck? Why are you... Uh... Here, hold on. Hold on. Uh, no, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, this is here to make things right. And, uh, to fuck things up, apparently, actually. Is he poisoned? Nah, he's blinded. Oh, okay. Well, that's just as good. Here, I'm gonna have Jimothy walk over here. Thundering challenge that. Steal fire from that. Can I, can I huck that over to the... I can't huck that over to the watchman. I can't huck that over to the... The welding? Damn. I can't huck that over to the welding either. I'll just interview with the bookshelf then. In any case, both of those guys shouldn't be able to do much. Yeah, blinded. Easy. Yo, Jamothi. What is up, dude? Let's take care of that watchman before Kadis fucking eats shit. Yeah. I don't think I could do much from here, though. Yeah, I, I had to withdraw and refuse again.
Um, if Kata stays there and just stabs at it, I think you'll be fine because you'll you're flanking it right now. Yeah, but even so, it's a dagger. It doesn't do too much damage unless I can ignore his armor. Well, you can leave the rest to rest the Jimothy because that thing's only got five health total left. Right. Um. But it's still got all its armor. Well, I I'd still try. Oh uh, yeah, I'll keep Kadis out because at the very least, like if he if he attacks Kadis, is not too bad. But if he attacks Jimothy, yeah, things. <laughs> Things could get uh, pretty dicey. Um, uh, we got 90%. Uh, oh, let's see if this helps at all. Wait, wait, let me splinter. Oh, that works too. Okay. Just we need, to, we need to get that welding. Yep. Um, splinter blast. There we go, this armor's gone. Alright, Jimothy, right, don't fucking die. A, the... Okay, it's fine. You're alright. Got the secret to man's red fire. Yep. Oob it, doop, 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 I wanna be like you. Oh, yeah, I know that one. That's the one that goes. Jimmy, doop, bop, 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 Pine Seeker. Well, I feel like is that going to kill? No, he, it's already, not. he already has the uh, the like stone it's, bow. It's like oh, okay. It, the other than the, like it, the fact that it doesn't pin, it's got one more stunt better. Than, yeah. Do we want to scrap it? Uh. <sighs> That's a hard choice. That's a hard choice. Technically, Jimothy and Darloff both have an empty slot. You could give them a ranged option if you wanted. Um, all right, fine. I'll give Darloff a bow. It's, it's like he an needs option. it, but <laughs> okay. Bonus damage from the bear Bonus strength necklace. Bonus damage. I feel like we'll give that Darloff. Uh, yeah, yeah, that works. Darloff, fuck. Me fuck. Me fuck for for money. Forehead. Uh, I'll click. I guess I'm the leader. Oh yeah, because it was like... Scuff marks on the floor. Mostly your characters. What? What'd you say you found? Only the evidence of a furtive mind. The implication being this cabinet was moved. Here, Jimothy. Give me a hand. Give <laughs> Nobody me calls head. him Jim. Shifting the cabinet takes a little sweat. <laughs> Do you think Jimothy hopes someone will call him Jimmy one day? Yeah. <laughs> but they manage. Definitely a hole in the wall. Wow, you someone's called reading, it. Someone's reading Nook, I bet. I'll have a look. That's why I'm if you hear any bone clack. This room is deeper than first seemed, and the air has that special smell. Book musk. Book musk! How much room is, how much room is there? You can come in. It's, uh, well, there's a library. The tomes are somebody's treasure once. Now again, they'll find loving hands. Spell threads, too. Uh, ooh, we gotta find two spell ooh, threads look in at there. That's pretty good. What the fuck is that guy? What the fuck is that? It's Batchby. Batchby. I, I've never, like, fought the Morthogi before, so I have no idea what we're up against with these guys. Uh, so what's our, do you, does our party want to secure the Duck Veil here? Uh, Sam says, in this universe where Jimothy is standard, would James then be a nickname? <laughs> <laughs> I think we should go find an item in here, because yeah. Jimothy's hurt, so he can get some time to recover. Yeah, it works for me. Yeah, and then they can... And then we can uh, meet in the middle. Working deep is strength... Five with only two. Should I? I mean, we managed to do strength five, and Darloff, Darloff, and Darloff's level two, and he has a lot of equipment, and Yuri is level fucking three. Like, I think you guys are fine. Probably. Okay. Probably. Russell, Russell, hoot, 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 Cree. Scarf. Blue skin. <laughs> it sounds like somebody's making noises that almost sound like animals. Not exactly a pleasant country, uh, country creek, is it? Feels tense. 
Taking mental stock of my limbs, so I'll know uh, how many I should have later. How about you? Um, excellent, Darloff. Just make sure you're the one to grab my boots when I die horribly from a bullhorn to the gut. Just can't wait to get my hands on these hell-hearted murderers. Come on. What, what the fuck? What the fuck? I feel like the second one is what Eerie would say. Sure, yeah. She's ready to throw hands. I'm just happy I haven't made you mad yet. I remember this could be a long game, Darloff. Oh, well, okay, they're friends. They are friends. Friends. They tolerate each other. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What? Oh, there's a fire spirit here. And another thing. Ha you fucker. A fire spirit. It ignores doors. I'm in, dude! Ew, bap, tree, dude. God, still fire is... It's the best one. doop a doop bob -a These guys are getting deep dicked. Ouch. Yeah, he's okay. He's fine, ladies and gentlemen. But think about it, Colin. You could get Darloff a flaming sword. Shoot it up, it up. It's probably long gone by now. Um, open door. It, it's got three turns Where left this turn. Did next, it go? Next turn, you'll have two. I really don't want Eerie to go for. Really, I have to actively like say like I. I don't want to walk through the fire. He's inspired. He's not inspired anymore. Boo, bop, tweet it. Done. I I don't know where the fuck the thing went. Unfortunately. Uh. That's right, Paladin. Yeah, he's got Paladin. He just doesn't have upgraded Paladin. Yep. No more catch the spirit. Fuck! I knew that wasn't gonna happen. Corbin had like a breakdown the other day. Yeah? Is yeah, he good? Yeah, well, no, it's it's a funny breakdown. Think... It's a jokey thing, because uh, because I reminded him that uh, Lightning McQueen is played by Owen Wilson. Did he just actively forget about that? <laughs> yeah, he had like no idea. He was like, "That's Owen Wilson," and I was like, "Yeah, of course." And I was like, "No way." How do you just like, forget that's us, Owen Wilson? <laughs> and I was like, "How do you not know this? Like, what universe are you in?" Uh. Why does that knock him back? It's a slinger, Ob man. Obnoxious. You were obnoxious. <laughs> Kill him. He's getting away. Getting away. Fucker. Fucker. Dodge plus dodge. five. He wants dodge. I'll take it. I'll take it, says Kate. It's the <laughs> Kate is the fucking bitch. What do you want to do? Not take damage? Idiot. Horn children. I'm not worried about deepest stuff because that's not our main enemy. Uh, we could secure a narrow sand mine, I guess. Or we could just move on to G Gilwoods. Gilwoods. I don't know. That's up to you. Um. Uh, why not? Maybe you, could do, maybe you could do that one quick, huh? Gilwoods? Alright, there we go. Oh! Your <gasps> sight. What's the new item? Necklace Bonus of power. Damage. Um. I guess just Cadus, since he's the only other guy who deals damage, like not magic damage. Yeah, fine. 
Uh, hold up. Oh, shit. Where, where are they going? Where, where are they going? Uh, I'll bring them. I'll bring them closer to you guys. Yeah, there we go. Uh, I kind of want to get rid of the spec. I want to get rid of some of those. Two. <laughs> Fuck me, dude. Those two I'm fine with because like we're not dealing with gorgons or deepists yeah. quite as much. And I, I can feel I can deal with a bog more. Somewhere deep in the swamps deep of the, the swamps of and, and, and Gangan Dragon, and Dragon, Dragon Widows. Widows. Anyone else hear that? No. Hear what? I don't know. It's like some kind of. There it is again. Thank you, Colin. Probably just some animal. That sounds hurt. Maybe we should look for it. I'd bother. We still got a long day before we can make camp. Hello? Hello, are you... <gasps> what is it? What did you... What is it? What did you find? <laughs> it's a child. It's a Draven. <laughs> They're all astonished. I think we should help it. What? what? It's young. It's hurt. It's a Draven. It won't survive the night. Good. It's a monster. Letting it die would make us the monsters. It's not a threat to anyone right now. It's scared and in need, need of help. We should help it. I want to help it. I mean, Jimothy's right. Yeah. <laughs> Who said anything about letting it die? <laughs> we, we've agreed Jimothy can't do wrong. Right, yes. Um, they'll, they're they're going to help it. It's a fifty percent chance. What? Oh, oh! It just gets rid of a drowning card for us. I'm gonna assume that means the fifty percent chance worked. If we're, go <laughs> if we're gonna help, help it, I'll need a fire. Candice, can, can you give me water and bandages? Bleeding heart. Blah, 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 bleeding heart. Ragged, ragged, ragged. Motherfucker. It's all right. You're gonna be all right. <laughs> he looks fucking pissed. He's mad. All through the night, Jimothy tended to the injured Draven until... Hey, wake up. Hey, wake up. There's... Where's the thing? Where's the thing? Ah, huh? I dozed off. It's gone. Ah. It must have run off during the night. Figures skulking away just like a Draven. It didn't hurt us, and if it was strong enough to get away, then that means that we did help it. Glad you're happy, because someday we're probably going to meet it again, and, it'll, and, and we'll have to kill it. Let's pack it up. We got a long road ahead of us. Oh. Hopefully, we can make the lo make up the lost time. Goodbye. And good luck. He's a good boy. Okay, it removed a it removed a Draven card for us. That's that's pretty hot. Um, we want we want more fight boy armor, or do we want more V sided armor? I think we do two hides again, because we've got we've two got, hides. We still have three people that need hides for armor. Yeah, even with two wizards. Let's go. Oh, Guile Woods from Straight Fighter. Ooh, there's a mine here. Strength five. You just did strength five. Yeah. Let's go. Pot. Poggers. Where's my lucky coin? Can't be that lucky. It can't be that lucky getting itself lost. <laughs> Stupid idiot. Could have been in the spoon or the socks, could it? That'd be the coin. That coin's responsible for more victories than you'd think. I forgot it on a hunt that one time and I couldn't hit it with a thing. You have a stick. You know, friends help friends look for lucky coins. Okay, <laughs> let me just... Look up the issue. Holy shit. Oh, is that it? Oh, shit! I think she can get a fucking familiar. Picky little mouth. Get off my coin! More foggy.
83%? Those are pretty good odds. She would not ask for help. She's just going in. Plus two damage potency? <laughs> Against all this Morthaki? Hold on. Smart move, dropping it before I caught up. And then machinery noises. Well, at least the luck returned quickly. See, those are called Morthagi. Morthagi. She's talking to the animal. And now we know where they're oh. congregating. Congregate. You know what? Never mind. Theory? I've got the coin, and we've got a leg up on the Morthagi now. She's trying to teach it to talk. Oh, look at me. That, uh, look at me, pretending like you're people. I bet you don't even know how to do taxes. Oh, it's a watchman. Right there. Oh, great. Oof. Oh, there's a batch bee. Oh, that thing's big. He's damn. He's thick. What is? What does he do? Let me see. Eleven health. Grab. Uh, five to six damage. Or alternatively. Engage. More foggy clamp. Swift action engages the target, forcing it to attack them. Ouch. Okay. You ain't shit! Yeah, that wasn't too bad. And Darloff leveled up. Nice. He's a swole boy. We can upgrade Paladin. Yeah, Paladin's pretty good. I kind of like, of all these things, I kind of like uh, upgrading Paladin. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Potency. Owl Wise Ring. Finally gave that to one of the uh, Mystics. Vizids, yeah. We'll give it to Eerie. So you got the coin back. Yep, the little rascal must have had a change of heart and dropped it. Kind of cute. In an ugly way, maybe. You're a little goober. Come on, you want to be friends? Oh my god. Is it going to be Darloff's friend or Eerie's friend? I feel like it'd be appropriate for it to be like Eerie's friend. As long as you can take care of yourself. If my coin goes missing again, I'm gonna use you as a monster bait. Me and my familiar. Get a pet. Well, there's there's the two card that we tried to get rid of. <sighs> Sometimes it just be that way. Um Yeah. We can uh You can do a quick can... secure. You wanna work faster one? I think I think maybe we do it work faster, and then I, I I don't think I've ever done a work faster. If it goes really fast, you can do two secures and then meet up with us. Okay. That's not bad. Um, um, we can we can send him to Fox Poplar. That's really fast, actually. That's pretty fast. But you don't get a free item. Yeah. Fox Popper. Fox Lar, says Sam. Alright, these these have uh, not the Morthagi, so this should actually be like an easy peasy fight. Uh, what is it? It's the Gorgons. Oh, th there's like three Gorgon cards, aren't there? Like, the yeah. biggest one I think is a Bogmore. Trees here and actually look younger than the wider woods, kind of odd. The Haker Mulchy Hill above Broomfield Congri. 
taking their final approach. Why do I not remember yesterday? I'm going dull out here, I swear. I feel like I need this battle. Great heat, a grind to sharpen me. Try to say something? Timothy's leading the way, and it's he who spots the warm glow ahead. Did it flicker to life just now, or maybe it had only been hidden behind trunks? Oh, I think this is a transformation. Nothing exceptional was ever recorded about this place. I wonder what drew him here. The beast things. They're not like me or you, anyway. We'll get our chance to find out. See a fire up ahead. Campfire, maybe. On traveler? Or a trick? Time for weapons. Got the flame swirls. Oh, yeah, this is a transformation. This is fire time, baby. I got a flame swirls. See, these are actually pretty cool transformations. Uh, Myth of Sable Rocks. Silent, bright, and smokeless. It's not a place to hang your kettle. It's beautiful. I wonder why it's not hot. Not hot. It's blistering. I feel it. Jimothy, you all right? Do you hear stories? Or is that just my mind that hears them? Jimothy moves nearer to the spiraling inferno. Apparently unscorched. Jimothy. I'm alright, I'm I'm remembering now. I remember one tall story. It's brief, it's for children. In early days the sky's back was not so stiff. She bent and saw a handsome grey squirrel who'd climbed to the top of a redwood. Kinda thought it was weird that she thought a squirrel was handsome, but you know, whatever. Jimothy, you're, you're getting, getting really close. The squirrel, he chatted to her blithely. Now he relished her stars and the autumn wind. Took comfort when she cast her cloudy hair. He thanked her for letting the sun thread through it. Youthful and uncautious. And unused to such adoring words, she became drunk on them. Kind of weird that somebody could get drunk on words, but, you know. It's a weird story, I guess. So anyways, when she watched him plant his forests and watched the trees grow tall where he placed them, the sky thought to impress him by planting her own. A lightning arm. She gently lowered and a great tree of scarlet was born, but it was a greedy tree. It grew and grew and grew so large that it consumed the forest the squirrel had planted. And without time for a word, words took much longer to say in those days, it swallowed the squirrel's body too. Seeing this, the sky grieved and grew in wisdom. Upon the wildfire, she poured celestial waters, the first rain, and ever after, when she lowers her lightning, even in wrath, she bolsters the earth in rain, lest her anger run beyond its intended course. That's the story I remember, and this place remembers. It's a piece of here, something left behind. What's that mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Stories of fire, you don't hear them? They leap and lick in my imagination at this altar once. People would gather and tell them. Talk about squirrels. But they're dead now. <laughs> Those people are dead, and the flame somehow endures. Endures. Jimothy, come away. You should be burning. How are you not? Listen, I'm going to let it touch me. It's up to you. Cadis leaps to intercede. Jimothy reaches into the flame. Sam says, really hope that goddess did something more to honor that squirrel. What happens if Cadis leaps to intercede? I guess he just gets fucked, I guess. This is ludicrously hot for him. Anyone can cry over a dead squirrel. We'll do, we'll do Jimothy time. Jimothy, what? no! He leans close and lets the fire climb his wrist. It's alright, I'll be... All right, he stands unharmed as flames file up his arm, ordinary as ants, orderly as ants, but then... Yarg. A sudden mass of fire wreathes Jimothy's body. Jimmy! Just as it seems the whirling flames will devour him, they retreat into their coals. Jimothy stumbles back a few steps. Blah. What in... What in... Jimothy, here, here, my canteen's still full, let me. Oh, no, keep your water. 
It's not painful. It just kind of tingles. His hair has changed. But yeah, enough, his hair's going to be like severely oranger now, by the way. <laughs> oddly enough, I feel better than before. I feel ready for whatever's next. A big bestial. Bestial card walling starts up not far through the trunks. Jimothy Coon says, Sam. Mine's mine's here, and mine's mine says, Sup, pale. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> legacy points. Hot dog. Yeah, legacy point for that, too. I don't think Jimothy can hold his sword, though. Uh, you can't hold your shield. Ah, gotcha. That's not But too you get bad. a ranged attack now. Okay, that's not too bad. Jimmy! Let's see. Eat shit. Probably just like attack through him. Yeah. Sure, why not? Hey, a stunt at that point? That's pretty good. Old Jimmy here. Flaming arm. Old Jimothy here and his... Controlled by blue. And is being controlled by blue. Look at Blue the Demon wasting all this time. Fucking like asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy's got places to go. Open door. Ah. Oh, it's a thing. It's a bug moor. What's going on? So this is Wildermyth, which is a, uh, which in short is an RPG about, about characters that show up later. Um, basically it's about playing an RPG, and as you play through the RPGs and keep going through the different stories, you can build legacies between these characters. Yeah. Uh, basically, like the game does its best to like remember stuff that you've done and generate like an interesting enough story. We'll start with that, and then Cadis. Yeah, he's got this. Oh. And he can actually swap weapon. Maybe go for another hit. Uh, oh, he's standing tried. in he's standing in shit. Huh. Oh yeah, we're actually fighting Gorgons now. Huh. Yeah. Weird. Let's get let's get Jimmy out of there. That, that's a swift. That's a strike. Nice stunt from from Jimothy. Three damage. Oh, this something. this gives extra damage, right? Yeah, it does. Swap weapon. We'll do flash con since it's free. Might as well, and then do a strike. All right, that's. How embarrassing would it be to to have Jimothy bite it immediately following that whole fire thing? That would be pretty funny. Not gonna lie. Donk. Hey, you dunked him. Nice. Good stuff. Nine, eight, eight. Okay. Uh, I mean, it's Jimothy's story. Storm. Oh, we got clash. mace. Um. <laughs> replace his skinning knife. <laughs> I could replace. Yeah, I could replace his fucking dagger. Um. <laughs> I forgot. I re I re I named Darlov's great sword. The sword. The sword. <laughs> Technically, Cadis deals more damage if he's flanking. Um, I think he can keep it. I, I mean, I think we just salvage it 
uh, salvage it for an ingot. I mean, yeah, ingot ingots, ingots are good, good for for the big boys. Salvage. There we go. Okay. Salvage. Uh, fern shadow broke. Uh, well, it it's dodge. Uh, I mean, at this it's... point, we could probably give it to Jimothy. Oh, give it to Jimothy. I mean, he's he's getting hit a lot. Dodge will basically okay. replace his like. Do we want to replace? Do we want to replace his sword with the shield and just give his flame hand a weapon? Huh. Uh, I have no idea. Dust settles, the earth smells, and it smells acrid and burnt. You can control that thing, I hope. Huh? This arm? Yeah, I... Can you talk for a second, Timothy? Quick summary might be good. What happened to you? <laughs> Alright, so... I really did hear something, right? Whatever presence was in there at the altar, the flames that spoke in me more than to me, like the chorus of my primal ancestry... It wanted me to return to Monkey. <laughs> I heard them offer stories to the altar. Uh, sorry, Kavan? The Kavan of the Summer. The Queen of Embers, the Sun Thief, and the Empire of Ashes are softer stories, like that little yarn about the sky and the Tree of Fire. I'm sorry, but if something wanted to you return a monkey, why would its first initials be like. First initial reaction be to light you on fire? <laughs> I heard them, these flame keepers. People who drove their herds and built their shelters here, who poured out their mysteries by this altar that they must have carved, and... I needed to take that with me, and I was meant to be a part of its continuance. Felt like a directive from the universe. Well, who am I to tell you otherwise? It would be the point, also. I mean, look, if I didn't know who you were before... This would be more surprising, but, uh, you know, here we are. You didn't know who he was before. <laughs> you know, you he, just found him. He just found him. You're worried for me, aren't you, Cadis? It'll be fine. You'll get used to it. Man, like, Jimothy's, like, kind of a baller, dude. You're not going to tell me off, are you? Hmm? You've got to do your own thing. I get that. <laughs> Nobody likes Jimothy Firehands McGee? <laughs> Jimothy Firehands. What's his last name? Daniel. Daniel. We gave him two almost names. Jimothy and Daniel. Yeah, that's right. And then they were gonna... Do you want them to secure an item or work it's faster? It's three people? Maybe we can secure an item while, you, while you're scouting out that last place we need to go to? Yeah, that's fine. Ah, shh. We're, we're almost done. We hardly need to bother with it. Oh, it's coming from the place that we're going to anyway. Yeah, do we want to, like, intercept them at there? We got three ingots! Oh, nice. And a strap, and a of, strap divinity. of divinity! Um, warding. Who doesn't want to take magic damage? I feel All like right. either Jimothy or Darloff. Yeah. We can do, we can do Darloff. He's pretty stacked. Oh, look at my handsome man. Do you want to intercept them? I mean, you're already in the zone that they're coming from, right? Yeah, but I can't, like, attack them. Oh, I'm pretty I, sure. I guess we can send the three to get there. Why not? Gather. We can gather the whole squad here, actually, I think. Oh, what the fuck am I doing? No, they're 47 days away. They're going to go the long way around because we haven't scouted. What? Why can't they just walk over here? <laughs> then it's right there. Finish, finish scouting. I'm sure the three of them will do fine. Uh, are they gonna... Uh, hold on. What just happened? Whoa. Uh, clicky. Let's go. Okay, and then, and then we, want to gather. we all want to gather here, right? Yeah, this is just everyone do it. Let's fucking get them. Let's go. Let's fuck them up. The squad's back together. There's some stone exploding the splinters and they wish they'd gone. Their rankings limbs shine unmared. 
Pretty sure the de defenders respond. Almost too much visibility. Cadence? <laughs> stay hidden until the last moment? That's a 69% for me. Yeah, I think we do stay hidden until the last moment. Unfortunately, disguising their paltry force becomes a clumsy mix of crossed intentions. It sort of rains as they hurry to take better positions. Well, well rip well, that. Well, we tried. Well, we That's tried. the best we got. Whaling There's no armor wall. to this combat. Oh, you know what? Wall Fuck them! Fuck them, we got peons. Why? Because fuck them, that's why. Eerie provides one more damage too, mind yeah. you. If I keep ranged people as close to her as possible, <clears throat> so I can move her up here and then, like, so I'll just move her up here. Oh, that's a big boy. That's kind of coming over our flank, too. I guess in that case, I'll send Jimothy over here. I'm trying to see where it's like good. Yeah, discus, there we go. Um Okay, I can move Darla in the back too if you need to, because there's like I feel like up front there with the spectic is not really where everyone's needed. Alright. Ah. Is there something trying to bust through the fucking door, too? Yeah, it looks like it. As long as they don't stay adjacent, it's not going to be as bad as it could be. Um, I think me... I'm just going to have this lady retreat. Fair. I'm going to try and shackle this uh, big guy. Yeah, he's been for two turns. Okay. Yes, I can just have Jimothy walk up because he had the watchman next to him and that was kind of intimidating But now he doesn't have it anymore Yeah, now he's pinned too, by the way Yeah um, uh, Actually, which just means that he can do cone of fire Yeah, he's got that It's 30% I guess I'll try it Good. But at least fire behind Yeah, and you can interfuse with it or whatever Yeah um, I just bad. used her turn though to shackle him, but he'll be stuck there for tur two turns. Yeah. Uh, do you want Cadis to try and shoot the skeptic? The uh, spectic? The... Yeah. Yeah. I don't want to really. Uh, it's got fifty nine percent. I might be able to help. Can him. you move him like closer to Eerie and just get a better shot? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I think I'll move him here because I think this still counts him as in cover. Sixteen. All right. Nice. Cool. Uh, let's see if I can. Now, Watchmen up there is what I'm a bit nervous about. Plus, whatever's gonna come yeah, from the south. Yeah, me too. Also, yeah, there's also those things breaking in down Dude. below. That's ah, okay. Plus one watchman. New watchman comes in. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do Jimothy's cone of fire so you can interfuse with it. Okay. Um, but I am gonna move him back real quick. It's not on the ground. Hell yeah, dude. Um. Um, well, let me see what I can do with that one. Uh, 
Alright, pinned three. Okay, hell yeah, you love to see it. Uh, we're gonna put Myla and Flemmerin at the at the at the corners of the door here. Of Kate, just move that way. Yeah. Uh, can can Darloff move over? Yeah, he can move over there and then just slap his shit. Give him a good whack. Yeah, there we go. Darloff's right, got gonna... four armor. He's kind of a gamer. Darloff's doing pretty good. He's 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 come online, I'd say. Uh, we're gonna have Eerie just kind of withdraw from that kind of stuff, and I'm gonna trust Darloff to take care of that thing. Right. Oh. Okay, that's oh. fine. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, he's okay. Darloff's fine. Spectic comes in. Okay, Darloff killed the Watchman. Just I expected. Um. Okay, good with Thorn Blade too. You, yeah, Thorn Fang. You get another turn back. Um. How do you want to deal with the? Batch be up top. Uh, I think I think at this point he can just run up and whack him. All right, I'm gonna let me shred his armor first then sure. for you. There you go. One hundred percent. You love to see one hundred percent. And then I can interfuse with this pot holder over here. I'll steal fire. Classic Kill that move. horse. Steel fire is so fucking good. So fucking good. Fire Edge. belch, hate to see that. He's in, it's okay, he's... it's on you're engaged, that's kinda what you want anyways. Yeah, ninety-eight percent. Simple Darlo Simon. Yeah, Darloff's just still outside. I think there's nothing else outside with Darloff. Yeah, he's okay. Uh, let me check Eerie. Fire Leash. Fire Belch, dead. Simple. Um. Where's the other enemies? I think they're coming from the, from the right, because I saw some, like, red squares over there that looked like they were spawning shit. Alright, fair enough. I'll just put, uh, Ellen Swin over there. At least that's what I think. I'm not 100%. Well, I'll just put her at the ready on the side. Oh, Jimothy. Darlaw. What do you see, Darlaw? Here, I'll move uh, I'll move Cadis up ahead. I don't see, oh, don't see it. Anything. So it's got to be to the south then. Or to the west. Or the east. That's true. You mean west. West, yeah, duh. Christ. <laughs> west, east, west. Uh... Yeah, because Cadis ain't seeing Jack or shit out here. Mm hmm. Yeah, Darloff's not seeing anything out over here. Just to double make sure. Nothing over here. Open the door. Yeah, there it is. It's like a spectic. That should be fine. I'm gonna move this lady back just so she doesn't. Oh, it's oh there it is. There it is. Donk. Oh, and a horse. Okay, that's why I kept... That's why we kept the others around here.
Alright, let's see. Okay, one more. There's there's three dudes. Okay, there's three more dudes left. Oh, the head. Well, hit. she died. Well, she's dead. Oh, dead. That's okay, it just happens. I think Jimothy is going to wait a bit. Shred some armor over there. Yeah, there we go. Throw it off here to fuck. Eerie's got some stuff to do. Eerie can't interfuse with anything in. Interfuse? The, the first interfuse is swift, right? Yes. So you can interfuse and then just like back up. There we go. Nice. That's nice. But still Don't pretty nice. Don't like them being linked up like that. Eerie. There we go. Interfuse with that. Beautiful. I'm gonna have uh, Jimothy flank. Okay. All right, you don't need his help. I understand. <laughs> All right, I get it. She said she was 12. All right. Uh, not terrible. Somebody Jimothy did die level. while we while on our watch though. So that uh, was uh that was just the townsfolk. Uh, Jimothy is now a blue horn warrior. Bard? Really? It's actually cost Jimothy one action. Ha. Huh. Huh. Hmm, that's pretty cool. Uh, Bard. We... Wisdom. <laughs> There's we, wisdom. We could upgrade his flame soul? Oh, yeah. Wow, that actually makes it, like, ludicrously good. Um, and he's only got one limb, like flame sold. Yeah. You want to do that? Um. Yeah. Let's let's lean into that. All right, and then we bring everybody to the Hughes chimes. I'll just go ahead and do that. Oh, we must achieve our other objectives first. Oh, fuck. It is your abuted street, Genie. It would teach you fuck off. Jimothy and Cadis go to pay their respects. Um, we gotta do it. Who? Jimothy and Cadis? Oh, fucking, I hate these losers. <laughs> After this rain comes, the farms will prosper again. Wow. Well, rain. Not if there's no farmers left. It's been a dry fall. That's all I mean. I'll okay, use the restroom up here, back because okay. these I'll, are your two characters. Sure, I'll do it. The, fur the f funerary rites are brief. The crowd that's gathered is impressive for such a small town. As mourners disperse, Jimothy and Kate spot eerie... Is somebody else who shares the same name? Standing by a flower-strung cart bearing a, ha a leaf-shrouded body. Eerie. We're sorry to hear about Ethera. A lot of folks came. Ah, friends, how many years has it been? They go with him, up the road to his home on the hill. You lose perspective sometimes. Easy enough to do. You think you have years together. Decades from your first cake to your middle years. Old age and... But... The two help Eerie transfer the shrouded body to a small prepared clay room beside the house. They settle inside and he tells them of his plan and of the provincial, provincial custom he's observing. Green veiling, it's called. A woven shroud of Don, Don's word. Don's word grows thick around here and in the little woodlands, you'll see. 
It's a strong aroma. The body stays fresh, sometimes as long as four years or five. We hill folk will generally build a clay home for the departed on the house's shady side. A wad shun is the old word for it. It means memory house. She'd normally lie there for a term. Then the Shroud of Dawn's word turns black, she'd be buried. I wonder about it. Keeping the dead so stupid. close, whether it's good for you. It's fucking stupid. What happened? They start smelling. <laughs> I don't plan on waiting. You don't plan to wait? So you plan to bury her oh, soon? Tonight even? I got hungry. No. My wife, Ethira, and I will be, we will be going on a journey, and I hope you'd come along. Uh, this guy's name is, like, also Eerie. Um. By the way. What? Yeah. No. Oh. No, change his name. Oh, I can't. A hard no! sound all this chittering and droning like a swarm. Yes, I'd hope you'd come. Be our escort. It's a dangerous world, and you're both strong. Stronger than even than I remembered. Hope I'd come, huh? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> That's what Cadis says. <laughs> Hope I'd come, huh? You just get fucking, like, clubbed. <laughs> Stop saying come. <laughs> come. Haha, <laughs> come. Asshole. Alright, well. Are you gonna? Are you gonna? Try fall, that's, that's all I mean. Well, we're here now. I'll come along with you if you need protection. Or, I think we have some other things to take care of. Will we have time to come back? Fuck it, let's do it right now. Jimothy and Cadis are called to a hill village where an acquaintance of theirs has lost his wife. Wait, we just read this. You want it to, want it to just be... Jimothy and Cadis? Um, Jimothy, Cadis, and one of the newbies, I guess. Or just the Ellen Swine, since Ellen she's Swine. the one newbie. Or maybe, actually, let's just have let's just have it be the both of them. You guys, you guys are about to do a fight. Okay. These chimes. Oh, it's a what butler. Fuck. Uh, I think we just get rid of the Watchman extra damage. Those guys are kind of already roasting our... Roasting Watchmen us. Watchmen are too much, Jesus. <laughs> the story continues! Eerie leads his oxen cart carrying the body of his wife down through the hills and into the arms of an old forest. Mist rolls in as twilight takes hold behind a cloudy sky just west of Nina's tomb. This forest was named Laganid when it was on maps. Absent forest, it meant. It's not an encouraging name. Can I ask about Athera? I don't think either of us ever met her. The place I'm looking for shouldn't be far. I remember you talking about her. I'm sorry, she never came with me to three barns. Always wanted her to, but she was never quite well enough. <laughs> <laughs> she insisted on staying home to tend the farm. We met when we were seven. I would visit her with bread and pies when we got older. I can't say when it changed, only that two it did. Barns. And then we moved to two barns. Oh, wonderful place, two barns. You should have seen it. Anyways, about my dead wife. A gift or a smile between neighbors starts to mean more. We built the farm there on the rocky hill. <coughs> she liked the farm. She was a good and honest woman. Shy, though. She was born with an, with an illness that never fully left. Our good times were great. But our bad times, when she couldn't rise from bed, those made my heart splinter. And one day it shattered. There's one thing I know. It's that I don't want to live in that empty house without her. The forest had been dead quiet, and when they entered... Uh, when they had entered, and as they had gone deeper, noises have filtered into hearing. Drips, scrapes, low trills. The smells have turned richer of damp earth, spicy bark, quilted mosses, and purple, green, and beige. Soon the ox halts, and they come to a clearing where a goddess lives. Oh. Eerie? 
You expected this. Yes, I intended to find her. The reason I brought Athera here, the reason I'm here and you're here. Orway. She's a goddess of borders and in-betweens. This realm of hers welcomes both dead and living. So, I'm here to join her. Athera and I can be together still. What? No. Here you gotta slow down. Clearly, clearly this idea has been germinating for some time. Look, it's this forest. I read about it, this goddess. She, they rule it, like a region between our world and a place for the departed, I suppose. It exists for us, for those like us. A place Athera can be without pain, and I can be with Athera. What you're talking about means giving up everything else. I won't be able to leave this place, but why would I wish to? I'll still live. She will too. We'll just live here. You have to understand. This is all I want. All I need for you is to help me complete the ceremony and take that poor ox back with you. Try to imagine if you had somebody that meant everything to you. Your whole world. I don't know, that's up to you. Huh. Huh. Th this, is, this is a weird one. This is a, this is kind of a difficult one. I want to see what happens if he does it. We can't just not, right? Okay, if you insist. Well, Yuri, if this is what you say it is, how do we help? How do we make sure you get what you want from it? We'll lay us both at the foot of the shrine and then she'll test us. Or away well. We tend to test well, I'd say. It is dangerous. We must duel Orway's guardian. That's why I needed you along. Oh, I have to fight a thing. Oh, no, baby. Oh, baby. If you decline, I'll understand. Then I'll fight it alone. You're not a fighter, Eerie. Hold on to Athera. We'll beat whatever she puts in front of us. Pull Athera's shrouded body from the cart bed. True to its reputation, the woven, the woven vines of Dawn's word have kept her perfectly preserved. PP, if you will. With Athera across Eerie's lap, and the two rest at the foot of Orway's shrine. Beneath your mercy lie two who wish to roam your realm together, live in your lands, and laugh again. Please permit us to stay. Send your guardian, and my champion shall stand to fight it. Send your guide, and my love, and I shall go behind. Garlands of mist wrap and twist around bows, statues, arms, and legs over the damp, dusted cheeks. The quiet air clumps in their throats. But then... The voice of Orway is, is a groan, far away and felt more than heard. It's in the stones and in the roots and rises from somewhere deep down. Truth is tested. A noise nears them, crashing through the trees. Retainer of the Old God. This, well, this, have fun. this could be really bad because uh, Jimothy and Cadence don't have any way to shred armor. Mm. Each movement, its body crunches and crap crackles, leaping violently forward. And that thing is made out of rock, dude. It deals four to six damage, move through scenery, and stomp it flat. Three armor. Oh! Well, eh. Have fun. Well, the upside is. It's not it moving. Didn't do anything. Can, am I able to just like cheese this? Okay. What the fuck does All it right. not see you? Hell yeah! I you love to see it. You love to see a free game. Can you just what? Hell yeah! We're gaming. Also, didn't miss any of those shots. Easiest game of my life. What the. Fuck. Your deity ain't shit. Armor and potency. Uh, damn, armor and potency, huh? Uh. Oh, uh, potency. Potency is, uh, magic shit, right? Mm hmm. 
Let's give it to Jimothy. I think his I think his fire shit is based on potency. Okay. Guardian, Guardian. Falls. What a what a fight. What a, wow! What a great fight. Everyone was very impressed. It's great stone knees clattering apart, rolling in the moss. The wheeling rocks gather dust and shadows as they settle until they look like they've rested there for centuries. The glade grows calm. And then Eerie starts to fade. Goddess? The wrapped body of Athera across his lap seems to lose its substance. He has time to say, thank you, friends. And he's gone. <laughs> well, now that... Now, well, now that's done. Hmm. Where'd the ox got to? <laughs> yeah, good thinking. They find it, not far off. Lowing pleasantly and munching clover. We all have to choose and walk our own paths through this world. Couldn't deny him that. I'm with you. Just find it tough to think about it, I guess. We all did what we did. They're in the hands of a goddess now. Adis? Still awake? I picked these up around the stones, where Eerie disappeared. Didn't even think about it. I'm making notes. They return to the farm Eerie and Ethero once built. They set things in order and see that it passes to a worthy family. Then they're on their way again. The road is pale, splashed and torn in places with ruts and grass. Stretches of the journey are entirely wordless. What's on your mind, Jimothy? These memories, old wishes of ours, it's hard to let the good things go. I know it is, and I feel... sometimes I... I don't know. Yeah. Mm. Come. Come. A road of... A, a road the color of old canvas billows in front of him, behind them. The bold come. He's a big man! He's the biggest man! What's he gonna get now? He could just also get Paladin. Long Reach could be funny. Uh, I was tempted to get that for uh, Orin when he had his fucking spear. Yeah. Um, uh, well, uh, we'll do Paladin. Paladin's just good. Uh -oh. Yeah, that's always, yeah. Good. that's always a good skill. Uh, well... Uh, let's do wolf call, fuck it. Okay. I want to make them distinct from each other, huh? Okay. Okay, um, okay Jimmy. Was... You guys okay. are about to thrash. Um... Uh, that's why I was scouting this area. Just happened. What? Uh, I'm, I'm pausing because we oh. didn't set them to do anything. And you guys are going to be a bit, I'm going to guess, so might as well... Get some shit done. Get us some ingots. Wow. Wow. Come. Yeah, okay. This is it. Hunneth Henge. I thought you were around here somewhere. Keep your eyes peeled. I'll fight soon enough, but first... Who are you? What are you doing here? Oh. The fellowship of the silent song, but never mind that. Oh fuck! The sound of the edge isn't it one of the best brews of the side of the spare ones? Your spares have been called the nectar of the gods. Yeah, this is one of the edge, and you heard right about my spares, but they ain't brewed nothing the past few weeks. But why? Why is Curse Muthagi scum? This why? They drink too much. Come on in, see for yourself. Oh, that's putrid. Mm. I'll use my finest <laughs> my establishment. They got me brewing up this vile concoction for them. I bring them fresh batches every few days in the ruins, pour it right into their veins if they have veins, that is. Come. There's something wicked to them. This brew makes them faster and stronger. Why are you helping them? Hey, yeah, my husband. What? 
<laughs> we'll get your husband back. I, I don't know what you mean, like, <laughs> Darloff. Darloff just, like, <laughs> he fucking injects himself with pure alcohol and fucking just passes out. <laughs> Drunken fist monk, but also uses a fucking like car as a weapon. Those will be home soon. We'll get him back. You, you mean it? I haven't seen him in so long. We're on it. Honest engines. Plus two foot guards on turn three. Okay. That's a lot, actually. Damn. It's me, Ellen Swine. Okay, I, Alan Swine is moving. Oh, sorry. It's fine. I'm used to controlling her. That's a big boy. Sweep the floor. I get it, because it's a butler. Love oh. fire belch. Butler, okay, slam, cool. 5 to 6 damage. 10 to coals. Once per turn as a free action, consumes up to 3 nearby fires, creating a damaging region around itself that increases, that increases in range for each fire consumed. Sweep the floor. Once per turn as a free action, consumes up to 4 nearby debris, gaining temporary HP for each. Bone Stitch. Gives 4 of its temporary HP to another ally. Okay. So you don't love to see... I'm going to actually put out one of these fires so that it doesn't use that ability. How about that shred? Hey! <laughs> Die! Guardian should be up soon. So, oh, okay. Fire belch again? <laughs> Ooh, die. Oh. <coughs> Watchmen. We're like, uh <laughs> We're like, oh fuck. Oh fuck this. Oh wait, whoops. Very good. Discus. God, Roman, can I watch one like one of those fucking old cheesy like Greek mythology movies with you? Uh, sure. Like, oh god, what was it? Jason and the Argonauts. Oh yeah, Jason and the Argonauts with the fucking with the fucking like uh, stop motion skeletons. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, I would love to watch that. That'd fucking be great. scream at the top of their lungs when someone moves an inch. If Eerie can kill that spectic, um... I'm sure she can. Hang on here. Spectics aren't really an issue, too. I just... The problem is, is that Ellen Swine's got no HP. And if, it, and if she gets hit once, she's probably fucking dead. She can okay. still help since she's interfused with that, that mossy stone, but... Let me just, like... Boom, impose this watchman, okay. And it left. Alright, okay. And it's gone. Just 
just interfuse with this shit for now and Let's just like start, have her wait so she doesn't fucking eat it. Let's just start withdrawing from some shit here. Get him. He's getting away. Get him. Fucker. <laughs> the Verminator is still the funniest idea of like. <laughs> right? Uh, I mean, Cadis gets this. Alright, cool. Hell yeah. I forgot Should his I name was. I forgot his last name was Tallow Drake. <laughs> what an edgy lord. Yeah. He made, he, made, he, made, he made that up himself. That's not real. That's last of them. You come out now, Ed Ver. That's your name. Ed Boy. It was incredible. You were amazing. But Run Baron, where is he? Look over there. <gasps> Run Baron? <gasps> come. Of course I did. <laughs> Gonna know without these folks, I can never repay you. But <laughs> you'll you'll never want for something fine to drink. Oh no! Oh yeah, the welding is better now. Oh, more welders! All right, now we can assault the place because we've gotten rid of all the Morthagi. Assault? Assault Hughes Chinese. Uh, if you secure that place, then everybody will be able to meet up at the same time. Find an item or work faster. Uh, find an item. Okay. Hmm. We've got plenty of time. See that, like, 140 counting down? Nice. <laughs> I hate that I that fucking Darloff has been Fucking blue-ass skin. Ring of Rhythm. <laughs> speed. What speed? Darlov? Jimothy? Um, I, yeah, I guess Darlov since he's got Paladin. Yeah, might as well. He can go where the fuck he wants now. Oh, and a cloak. More speed. More speed. <laughs> can we all oh. give more speed to Darlov? Can we do, uh, can we do Cadis, actually? Uh, oh yeah, sure. Uh, just let him move around while he's uh... 7.6 speed. All right. All right. I guess uh, securing the site for uh, Earl, Cadis, and Jimothy is taking a while. Uh, we had three people. You had two. Well, I guess you can start moving them that way and just like hold up for a sec. Hurry up! I'll be done. Hurry up. Hurry up. <laughs> we have a hundred and we have a hundred and five days, it's fine. What's that what's that Kingdom Hearts game? Two hundred and sixty-three in the third yeah, days. Like, like two hundred and sixty three in the third days or whatever the fuck it is. <laughs> I don't fucking remember, dude. Two ingots, love ingots? Love ingots. Knee pads of courage! Knee pads? Um, Who gets the knee pads of courage from him? Uh, I think Jimothy again, because he still he still doesn't have a shield. <laughs> he still doesn't have a shield. Uh, all right, everybody, everybody is going to come. You told everyone except like one. You told everyone except Jimothy. To well, come I didn't here. tell anyone. I... <laughs> <laughs> He's catching up slowly behind. <laughs> Wait up! Oh, to, to stop. Why is he slower? All right. Uh, fight. Yeah, she's, she's getting away. Fucker. Fucker. What the? What is that? A clock stopper? Given to the company as a gift, this axe repurposes old bits of Morthagi for the singular purpose of cutting down their fellows. What? Why is time passing? Wait, 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 whoa! Uh, I think we can let this one go through. Okay. But why was time pill passing? Who do we want to replace the clock stopper with? That's a tier three axe. It's a tier three axe. Um. You want to give it to Dartloff? Yeah. Fucking, think... f fucking one handed. Like, what's his dick? Only has one hand. 
He yeah, can't hold uh, it. Yeah, Kate, yeah, that goddamn Jimothy can't hold it. Clock stopper. Let me just get rid of the L. Clock stopper. <laughs> Somebody's just like, oh, here you go, Darloff. It's the clock stopper. And he goes, eh. Cock stopper. Eh, cock stopper. No, Darloff, it's called the clock stopper. Damn, no. look, at, look at Cadus with his, with his new duds. His <laughs> new duds. Dudes. Dudes. Dude. Oh! What? Haberdasher? Handles heavy metals, spews toxic smoke. <sighs> Make him to spew skulls like fog through the room. Why is it always something that he's fucking worth the There's always something. It. Cough, cough. Somebody destroy that thing. Somebody destroy that thing. Uh, kill all enemies, stop the toxic smoke. Stop being toxic. Stop being toxic. Sounds like we we're gonna need to hurry up and get rid of that haberdasher. Um, yeah, we can do that. Uh, I guess I can get Cadis on it. I'll have him hide over here. Not really inspired anymore. It's, honestly, it's just not that inspiring. I always want to kick a duck in the ass. <laughs> ah! Ah! <sighs> okay. You hate to see it. Okay. Okay. We need to fucking hurry though, man. Here, I think I think uh Darloff gets the first hit since he shreds uh since he shreds armor. That's true, uh, uh Axis shred armor. Uh Jimothy. Now everyone's wolf called. Can you interfuse and can I shoot shit from there? I guess we're about to find out. Uh. Um, I think we'll be okay as long as we take care of that thing really fast. I can shoot it. Um, let me see if I can get Eerie to shred any, like, she could probably take a step forward, or oh, if you get that bookshelf, that'll probably do. If I can get this bookshelf right here, yeah. Hell, it's got no magic resist. You might just straight kill it. Oof. Or it can just block that. Okay. All right, love to see that. All right, Darloff, get a move on. Okay, Jimmy. Okay, Jimmy. How about that? Speed it to blade. Ah, yeah. There, there we, we go. go. Oh. 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 <laughs> Needs one more bit of damage. Uh, let's see if I can get her to do it. Fuck it. Nice. Good shit, Colin. Whew. Okay. That's taken care of. Breathing certainly makes things easier. Jimothy! Hadoken! You missed! <laughs> you useless fuck. <laughs> I 
This no isn't all of it. There's there's a bit more to go. There's probably some more beyond this door right here. Yeah. I'll have I'll have Darkloth wait for everyone else. Slow as shit, Jimothy. Well, we can have small both the shit, wizards. Small shit island, Jimothy. Well, well, what we can do is we can have all the wizards infuse with shit in this room, open the door, and just back off and let them do their shit. Mm -hmm. I think we need to work a little bit smarter, not harder on this one, since we're all at half HP. Right. Darlof I don't know is, how much is left, too. Yeah, Darloff is looking okay, actually, because because he still has four armor, but it's not great. Uh, let's see, what, what do we have to work with here? Skull, lamp flare, wood. Uh, we can use splinter blast right there. Just have him pour through, like, through that shit, yeah. Here, you can you can have Darloff take cover behind something for now, and Invisible Cadis can, like, uh, open the door. Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh... Cadis. Uh, I'll just have him wait for now. We'll get like another turn for positions. Alright, gonna open that door. Uh, yep, might as well. Alright, Cadis. Uh, show us. How shit things are. A wardrobe? Oh, it makes things. Ew. So, the opposite of what we should have done. Okay. Ew. Great. I guess I'll just put Cadis in the room. He's invisible still, so... Okay, this is a bit of a problem, but... I think if I if I use Flash Cone, I don't think it reveals him since it's a swift action. Let's see, what can it make again? Uh, let's see. Oh, you be careful with her. Shoot, if she's if she's in there, I'm gonna throw the blind now. Yeah, I think she'll be okay. It's just Sam says, I'm gonna go snooze. I wish you luck and I hope you have a good night. Bye, Sam. Bye, Sam. Of course you made a welder. If you can shred armor, I think Cadis can. Yes. That didn't shred any armor, but. I mean, that's still good. Um... Okay, Jimmy. Adoken. Okay, that's really oh. good. And Wolf Gold? Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll call him a Duke. Uh, I'm gonna have, uh, Cadis, uh, go ahead and, uh, take care of that. Taking care of business. Every day. No. Okay. I was like, no, Cadis! You what? <laughs> Cockstopper. Jesus Christ. That's two level ups, maybe. Yeah. Pauldron of Dodge. Grace. Dodge um, five. Guess we'll put it on Darloff. Yep, we'll give Darloff some pauldrons. There you go. Alright, I'll swine. 
Um. Ooh, I like the upgrade to Spirit Blade. Yeah, I kind of like that. Standing next to Interfuse shit gives you crit, and uh, she can cast, but she can like do it in attack and give you more damage. Um. Ooh, archery's fun. Passive range attack against him or any adjacent allies. Counter attacks with a range attack of his own. Huh. Okay. I also like the upgrade to Flash Cone. Okay, affected the gray plane plus one use permission. Basically, if in, if you're in melee with something that's kind of saucy, he can he can blind it and put you health. in a gray plane. Yeah. I mean, it did that before, but uh, the fact that it can do both in one use is, would be really good. I don't know. Archery is also pretty good. Um. I think I'm going to do Flash Cone. Okay. Oof. Ah, good. I was hoping that was. No, oh, it wasn't them. How did things shake out? Also, all you say is oof. Oof. They've been disassembled. That's a polite way of putting it. We'll melt down what we can. So you pulled it off, and then. Good, let's. We can <laughs> rest for a bit. Is she having a stroke? <laughs> what do you mean That's a bit? Right. We destroyed their source, didn't we? Nothing's crawling out of there again. This workshop was not the only one ever in the operation. Why do you sound like, um, Shut Alan the fuck up. Okay. The most obvious ability to lie down and dormant and bide their time is one of their greatest strengths. I'm trying to get voice differentiation. Every time I see her, I keep thinking, if you could change your, your fate, fate, would you? Would you? <laughs> I hope I'm wrong, but in case I'm not, in case I'm around to help the next time. Not around. I'm like 70. It's a thing you have to consider when you reach my age. In case I'm not... Keep your wits about you. 11 years a piece fuller. Fella. Alright, what happened in these 11 years? Everyone's gonna be old. Ooh, we lost two more Thoggy cards from that. Alright, what happened? This is the truth. This cheese is incredible. <laughs> it was true. This cheese is incredible. Oh my god, my hair! <laughs> Two eight of airs where Darlov never went thirsty. He gets drunk every night. Where taps are always flowing when the party came by. Darlov! Oh my god! What the fuck happened to him? Everyone's so old! <laughs> I've always find excuses to visit Broomview Clangeries. Pan would, wouldn't sit flat as fire poker wasn't pokey enough. Whatever the reason, absolutely nothing to do with the strikingly handsome Smith who sometimes brought his for here. <laughs> okay. Dude, they spent a month tracking a golden stag. It was gold, alright. Anyways... <laughs> 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 he just went for the kill the stag looked him straight in the eyes he laughed Jimothy smiled back and lowered his arm and then he breathed fire <laughs> <laughs> oh, for an evening stroll Eerie accidentally locked eyes on the forest squirrel not another squirrel another squirrel incident <sighs> he has performed experiments and bits of monster part he was able to convince Eerie to donate to the cause those significant weaknesses were found. It's okay, hitting them with pointy things seems to work fine too. Eerie's crying his daughter? With who? Jane with Wayne. Him. Jane Wayne Gone Gether. <laughs> with who, bitch? <laughs> you just had this? damage for each interview's object at one point is prevented and the object takes two damage instead. 
I don't know. What do you think? Uh, I like Mythweaver. I do too. Or fire leg. <laughs> All fire foot they call. Yeah, plus one wa plus one warding and minus zero point one speed. Huh? Yeah, I'll I'll take that. Yes, please. <laughs> All right. I don't think I don't think Darloff needs any better weapon than he does now. Yeah, it really doesn't get better than that. You just immediately got a three tier three axe. Mm -hmm. Immediately. Uh, he could probably use some slightly better armor, though. You want to upgrade his armor? Well, what, what is he at? Is he at? Is he at one? He's just at, he's just at, he's just at his like old tunic. His oh, humble yeah. ginnings. His humble ginnings. The you could give him the fucking brawl guard. Give him crit. You want brawl guard? God. Gee, man. Gee, <laughs> man. God, that gives even more crit. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, we can give him the brawl guard if you want. <laughs> That's more armor, too. We'll, we'll come back to it, I think, because he's right. doing pretty well for himself. Oh, wow, we have enough for a tier 3 dagger for fucking Cadus if we wanted. <sighs> that would be kind of insane. What about Elneswine? Elneswine doesn't have anything. Yeah. Well, at least give her a better staff or something. Even just a tier one or anything? Uh, I think... Uh, we could give her Ember Gown, which would give her spell damage. Ember Gown? Yeah. That could work. Yeah, I have no problem with it. We have plenty of spell threads, actually. Yeah. We have 15 of them, Jesus. And fits we, her hair. We could upgrade her uh, her cloak and her like stick. Do like a tier one spell damage like stuff. Uh, own bow of siphoning. Yeah, we can do that. We got plenty of heartwoods and spell threads, so. Uh, we could do. We do. I don't think we have to do. The the leaf staff. Like. Okay. Yeah, because it's got a stunt effect. That's all it does. We can just right. do the the old normal staff, I think. Stick of poking. Yeah. King's blaster. All right. What about? Oh, oh fuck! We have another mouth to feed. We could just ignore him. awful oh that's right i forgot you have a familiar eerie oh yeah you got like a and pig. actually you're actually doing pretty well actually you got tier one robes tier two staff oh my god we should have given it to your guy the critter gives melee accuracy <laughs> oh god damn it oh, that's okay how could we have known how could we have known? All right, well. <laughs> she looks so lost. Anyways, enough of her. What about Jimothy? Uh, I th honestly, I don't think Jimothy wants for much. Uh, we could give him a tier two sword. <laughs> No, just upgrade Jimothy's sword. Yeah. A tier three sword. <laughs> we could do a tier three sword, but I I think I think it's fine. Alright. Tier two, then? Yeah. What's the sword's name? Uh Long Cry of Rose Town. If if I Flare. if I make it it's called Violet Song and I think that's pretty neat. Violet Song. Alright. Violent Song. <laughs> A powerful sword item description. Yeah, why not create? Um, what about what about Cadis? 
We can get this is a tier one bow, tier one armor. Tier one armor is solid though. He did just get it. Um. Remember, this adventure is five chapters long, I believe. Yeah, we've got a. Yeah, that's true. We've got a ways to go. Shit, so, we, might, we like, might not even have these guys the whole way through. Yeah, uh, we might be losing like the the first generation of heroes, so we have to think about the next generation. Yeah. At this point, especially like, look at Cadus. Like, damn. Look at that gray. But um, so we might want to think about like actually Jane Wen or. Something. Oh, we gave Jane Wynn a staff. Whatever. That's true. That's uh, fine. But we'll have to be thinking about replacing the warriors we might lose. Right. Along the way. Um, and, and we we only have one hunter amongst us. Yeah. Hmm. I mean, we still got some year. I think we still got like a chat, another couple chapters with Darloff and Jimothy still. Yeah. And Cadus. Cadus, especially if he, uh, if he actually gets his story thing going. If he actually gets a hook, yeah. Um, we could do like a tier two dagger and maybe upgrade the bow also on Cadus and then call it a day. All right, tier two dagger. All right. Um. Ice Spirit's Lock. I got it. And then... Yeah, we can we can up the bow, too. It takes most of our heartwoods, but that's it, mostly. That's okay. We'll be, we'll be getting more stuff like that, too. Great. What? You change your, what? It... I pressed on it, and now he has two bows. He has two bows now. Why? He has a tier two bow and a tier one bow. What happened? I clicked on. <laughs> um. Okay. Uh, let me click the bow here. Tier two knife. What happened? Well, uh, fuck. I guess. Let me try the knife. Let me try the dagger here. Okay, sure. Okay. Wait, does that work? Yes. Okay, there you go. Okay, thank, thank goodness. Alright, next. Are we good? Next. Oh god, they're old! Jeez, Jesus. Because they're beautiful in their, own, in their own way, but they're not people. They were never meant to be. You think you can stick your soul into one? What happen? What comes out of the other end will, will still be you. It's Leskin. 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 <laughs> <laughs> the alternative, death. If it comes to that, yes, because having some abomination follow me around, insisting it was you for eternity, what's worse torture than it? Honest loss. Honest, you're being selfish. You can't see beyond your own conception of what a person is. This could usher in a new era of humanity, and it wouldn't be humanity! I'll change your mind. I shouldn't have to. Not because I apparently care about you for whatever reason I can't remember at the moment. Jesus Christ! Let's lay skin. Where are lay you? Lay skin! Going? Come back! <laughs> Come back, lay skin! Don't you know that this is my coming year, I put your land at risk. Well, I thought you were up when they catch wind of any of us. Well then, why, why don't I waste our time and just ask directly? Can you make me into one of you? You know most of our body based on my studies of your, uh, of your late friend, but I need your help to finish the job. I'm a skilled metal worker and I was a decent fighter in my younger days as well. I can be an asset to you and your people. I'll just call this people in a long time. 
Are you certain it's not a safeguard against death? You've seen that first ad. I don't need a safeguard, I just need a way to halt my own decay. How old were you when you became enduring? As old as me? No. You know what it's like. Nobody does. Until they get here. Grow up thinking your elders just like complaining about their uh, aches and weariness. You think they like sitting on the same chair all day after uh, after watching clouds pass. You don't realize what they do. It becomes anything more has become impossible. I don't want to reach that point if there's a better way. Better way. And you have understood where others have not. It feels good to have something, someone understand. Come with me, we'll make our best effort. Reasonable amount of time later. Why her? <coughs> oh. I'm talking with the carpenter from Cheap Barns. Three barns. Three barns. Anchor. Oh, people tripping out of the surrounding regions by more foggy. Bill Shrew's silent song needs to help. <sighs> I assume you don't mean helping them build the houses. Ha! <laughs> nope, way more violent. I'm glad Eerie's daughter is just as violent as her. Brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> Alright, where are we going now? Slay all Morthoggy sites. Okay, the parties are separated again. So we got uh, Alan Swine, Darloff, and... Jane went. I'm changing her name. <laughs> dog shit name. Finny Fox. There you go. Okay. <laughs> all right. Okay. No, I'll change it. I'll change it to something better. All right. All right. Fine. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> what? <laughs> Not, don't worry about it. Give me a second. <laughs> what did you do to her? I've given her a stronger family resemblance. <laughs> there you go. I don't like the hair, actually. I'm, I'm changing this. <laughs> sure, why not? There's two of them. <laughs> Christ. Uh, All right, where's one party going? Where's the other going? Uh, is there a recruit opportunity? There is one at uh, three barns. Uh, right. So I think um, we, I think we can send uh, Eerie, Cadis, and Jimothy to the hills of Sorona. Since we gotta get rid of all the more. I think they. I think. I think they can go around and start slaughtering because they're actually experienced. Yeah. Uh, not you. Not you. Go. And then, I want to send someone to get to th go to three barns over there. Mm, what's happening at three barns? There's a recruit opportunity. Oh sure, and there's also like a deepest fight over there. All right. We'll have the three of them go there, and then once they get there, we'll... Thank you for naming her Firefox, by the way. <laughs> oh, it's a better name. Mozilla Firefox. Mozilla. Ma Maserati. Hills of Serana. My Serana. <laughs> it's the Mark Quarry. <coughs> oh, fuck! That's what I'm saying. My Corona. My Corona. Jimothy, put your fire away. <laughs> there are children here. Okay, I've got one. 
favorite fruit. Give me a good upstanding apple any day. As opposed to one of those morally questionable peaches. Next up, a difficult one. Favorite thing to fight. It's like asking my favorite rash. Least favorite then. Uh, might have to be more soggy. Is that because they're over the next hill? It's, well, I can never quite tell if they're alive or not. It's distracting. One of these days it's gonna mess with my aim. And here I am making a career out of them. <laughs> Nothing to say, Eerie. As old as I'm getting, sometimes I wonder if it's not too late to start over somewhere. I wouldn't know, realistically. I'd reek of abandonment. Well, we appreciate that. <laughs> Jimothy, <laughs> Jimothy is actually the glue that holds the party together, even though he Jimothy came later. Jimothy is actually a really good moral support. He came later. <laughs> he was the first to be recruited, but he's like the fucking, like... <laughs> he's like the dad. Well, what about you? What keeps you here? Come. Come. Uh, a duty pr to protect. Yeah, why not? He's a good boy. I I'm lucky enough to be able and willing to fight, and I owe it to the land that brought me up. What other sacrifice for me, I'll sacrifice in turn. Like this arm. Or this leg. Ow. Actually, ow. Uh, ooh, ouchie, wow, wow. Ouchie, wow. Wow, 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 we... Well, when you put it like that, it sounds... big. Sure. It is. I'm on fire every day. Uh, anyways, I don't know if that helps or if it's too much pressure, <laughs> but if it help, but it helps me when we get close enough to hear the clanking. Ah! Hero <laughs> gets plus one armor. It's a water spirit. Water spirit, come in it. Come. Oh, those fucking dudes. There's a lot of dudes. Hey, dudes. I hate you. dudes. Jimothy. Oh! Oh, oh, God! oh, the double, the double block. Jesus Christ, Cadis. Did you get it? Choo -choo oh. Water dagger, choo choo water bow, or a legacy point? I'll take a water dagger. Alright. I have a stone bow already, right? Uh, I believe your bow is stone, yeah. Oh? The oh. Whisper Edge. Water stunt effects, refunds an action point. Holy fuck, water's cool. Oh. <laughs> the slim shard. Uh, <laughs> just less stunt damage is all. The slim shady. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I claim it. I claim that. I claim that. Super hot fire. I spit that. He dodged it. He dodged it again. Why is there more folk cars? Oh god. Uh. Huh. This is where Kata says, huh. I'm out of here. Hmm. <laughs> 
Friend, your ass, Spectic. Uh, he can't actually hit that Spectic with any of his weapons right now. Okay. Can you hit the badge B? She sure yes, can. Yes, he can. The butler gets smacked. Right in the snack. Uh, what actually what Jimothy can do is. Uh... Shit, I'm an asshole. It's shit. It's shit. Good. Bone stitch. Tend the coals. Ow. His AoE is getting really big. Uh oh, I'm gonna. This is gonna hurt. Wow, it turns out trying to solve the problem of fire by adding yet more fire is not fucking working, Jimothy. Get in there. Kill him. The secrets to man's red fire. Fire. Um, swap weapon? <laughs> we do! I can be like you. I wanna fuck like you. Suck talk like, like you. you. Suck like you. You. You see it through. You do. Damn it, damn it. You see it through. Please. Stab him. Did you imagine this is right? You see it's true. It starts stabbing Moe. <laughs> Start stabbing a giant robot that's like twice his size. <laughs> fang axe like artifact. Tier two fang axe. Do we want to give that to Jimothy? Uh, 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 um. Do we want to give that to Mozilla Firefox? We we can give that to Firefox. Um. <laughs> Okay, so wait, what's what's Ellen Swine's gimmick again? I have no idea. Oh god, I don't know. Oh, we don't. We can't remember any of these fucking characters. <laughs> we, we don't remember anyone except like the first four. Let's let's give it to Firefox and see if we can't like make her like a muscle wizard. <laughs> Fang X, Fang X, fucks dick. <laughs> okay. Burned out. <laughs> yeah, I'm burned out too, game. <laughs> Extra armor on the batch B? Fuck off. Uh I guess we'll secure the quarry. We got we got we gotta find more equipment if we're gonna stick around. Yeah. Uh done. Find people. Don't upset the people. What do you wanna Oh, for me the screen is blank. It's just like who do you want to recruit? It's nothing. It just it's just a, a Raul. Raul. What's this say pick from legacy? Oh you no one you know. <laughs> no one you know. <laughs> it's like Jane, it's like oh yeah, I really missed out on that opportunity. <laughs> Who is it? Oh you know, and I just hear a gun you hear a gunshot <laughs> no one no one important. <laughs> Uh, who do we need? Is it a warrior or a hunter? Or yeah, a I hunter? think I think we need a hunter. Yeah, hunter you see, good. it's true. I want to suck off you. <laughs> I want to tuck like you. Tuck like you. Snarky greed wagon. Harith. Harith. I see him now. Give him like the Dan Avidan hair. Yeah, we, he, he, he does kind of have the Dan Avidan going on. Lee name Daniel Avidaniel. Let's give him a new name. Dan Avidan. <laughs> Dan Cripple? No, I, what? <laughs> what? Are we just gonna make Dan Avidan? No, we're not gonna name him Dan Avidan. Oh, uh, Dan... Backslide. Yankovic. 
<laughs> Can we just make Dan backslide, actually? <laughs> Can we make Dan backslide? Okay, uh, yeah, uh, sure. Okay, I got- Dan I... backslide. Back okay, I got, uh, I got- <laughs> oh, Fuck I'll, me! I'll, I'll do history real quick. Um, what I'll do is colors. What, what color is he again? Dark heart. Um... What color is his skin? It's like sallow, It's green. Like... Yeah, but like, what- uh, I'll just pull up a picture of him. Let me pull up a picture of Dan backslide. Um... He he's a dark heart. He's proud. He's um. He's oh god, what is he? Dan backslide. Oh, he's like like upchuck, like blue green. Oh, I almost got that perfect. Almost. Uh, let's see. Oh, we'll give him shame. Yeah. Oh my God, Roman! I almost got this like perfect color. It's it. I got it. It's, Look at this skin color. Here, I'm gonna Google image search of Dan Backslide. Let me see. Let me see if I can find the right hair for him now. Let's see. He, yeah, it is kind of like that. You, you did kind of do it. Uh, is there? Do we have any facial hair that matches that like mustache though? Uh, that's a good question. No, it's all beards. It's all beards. Um. I'll do stats. Greedy top. What, what, what else is it? Greedy coward. Greedy cowards. Um. Snark. Snark. Put leader down at the bottom. <laughs> put, put leader and romantic down at the bottom. Oh dear, Doris Standpipe. How I love How her. I love her. Father's money. Father's money. Um, we'll do like hot head for four. So, oh no, wait, we have to crank up the goofball just a little bit. So he's greedy, coward, snark, hothead, goofball, poet, bookish healer, loner, romantic leader. That seems good to me. Oh, oh that's good. I like that. <laughs> um Oh we wait, 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 wait primary color. We gotta give him that like what what is it? he's wearing like purple, right? Yeah, what the fuck? He turned back. No! Dan No Dan You can't escape me, Dan Bring back your sallow green vomit color. <laughs> What, what what does Dan is it just purple? Uh, he's got purple and like this salmon pink. Uh, as like he, a second. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to find a full body of Dan back, so he keeps getting zoom ins. Purple, like his bow tie is green, but I think like his undershirt is salmon pink. Yeah. Right? Here, what do what do you like these two? It's it's like closer to like a lavender, but. Um, put a little more red on the on the pink there. Okay. A little bit more red. Like that. Oh, it really does. It really, he really just wants to go back to being like, being <laughs> like Middle Eastern. Oh, yeah. I think it's because I'm, I'm like, fucking I won't let, but I won't, I won't, I won't let you, Dan. I won't allow this. Oh, there it is. That's the green. That's the one. That's the green. Head and face. Uh, hair. Where's the pompadour? <laughs> we need to put the pompadour back on. <laughs> Do we want to keep the chin? Do we want to keep I, that I chin like here? The, uh, mm. What about the goatee? He is evil. This one? It's kind of lopsided. <laughs> what about this? Oh. I mean, our option is like that or like maybe... <laughs> I kind of like that one. All right, uh, you you okay. you fuck with the colors and stuff. Last time I fucked with it, it all went straight to hell. Okay, um, I'm gonna do the. I'll try doing the salmon pink then. He's more red. Oh, it's close. It's close. Yes, that's the salmon pink. There it is. That's good. 
and he's like tall. He's tall and, and thin. narrow. Yeah, he's tall and skinny. Right. Okay. And then you gender got a male, name. masculine, attracted to women. Dan backslide. Backslide. And he is a thief. Dan backslide the gre cowardly greed wagon. I love him. Oh, what a fucking sex machine. Crude. Get him. <laughs> <laughs> What's the voice, Dan? I don't. I, we can't, dude. We can't do a Dan backslide voice for the whole stream because he just talks in yelling. <laughs> he whispers and screams. You Don't could, try to play it down. Yeah. I've heard about you, and you know what? It stands out to me. You're you're, you're like teetering on the edge of like uh, of like Robbie Rodgers. <coughs> Don't try to play it down. God. You're pulling back an entire world's worth of encroaching darkness. Apart from that, what's <laughs> It's Dan Backslide. Yeah, I'm really happy. What stands out is what these monsters can do. Mechanical lurkers that never sleep. Giant bugs that can control dreams and thoughts. Gorgons that can do... Whatever Gorgons can do. What if we could harness some of that power? We could launch... We could launch... Herd... Or whatever the fuck this place is. <laughs> Herd... Herd Herderoke. 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 A new era! <laughs> <laughs> it's monster crap, no kidding around that. But I mean, I see the appeal of a mechanical servant. <laughs> I'll steal it. <laughs> I'll steal it. Uh, whatever, your, whatever your motive... If you can shoot him, you can loot him. We'll train you up. He's a hunter, right? Oh, yeah. God, look at those colors. <sighs> I can't imagine a buff. Backside. Could you imagine? <laughs> Could you imagine a ripped-ass <laughs> Dan backslide? I, I I really need somebody to like poorly Photoshop like Dan a Backslide's face onto the buff Riku. A more thoggy. I'll kill it! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, who's sticking around to actually train Dan Backslide? Um, <laughs> that's a wonderful question. Dan needs help getting his gear ready. Um, we got Darloff there, we got Mozilla, Firefox, and then Ellen Swine. <sighs> uh, if you want, my crew can go north while you guys go south to the Emerald Dash Pines. Or actually, yeah, it might make more good? sense for you guys to go north since you're already closer in that direction. Uh, okay. Alright, who's going there? I said send Darloff and then... God, you're looking old, Darloff! <laughs> he's got, he's got wrinkles Maybe... in places that I didn't expect wrinkles to show up. I don't know, who do you think we should, should go with, who should go with Darloff? Mozilla or Ellen Swine? Oh my god, you know what's fucking insane? What? Cadis would take the almost the same amount of time to get there as as you guys. What the fuck? What the fuck? Huh. That's actually Weird. insane. That's strange. <laughs> Do we all bring Cadis along? Uh I mean I'm down for it. Hey, we'll bring Cadis and like uh, Mozilla. Sure. Yeah, sure. Mozilla. Oh my look god, at look him. at him go! He's moving, dude. Secure site complete. Fern, Fern Shadow Sash. Everybody has an empty slot, but we kind of need to start thinking about then the new gang. The youngins. So I guess Ellen Swine or Mozilla. We'll give it to Ellen Swine. Yeah, that's pretty good. He's oh, uh, where are they going to go? Uh, they could do Emerald da Emerald Dash Pines. Then they can meet up with uh, what's her dick? Ellen oh, Swine. Oh yeah. 
Cadus made it. God damn. Let's do it. Cadus can Dan fucking schmooze. We have Dan backslide in this part. <laughs> Dan backslide's gonna become. If he doesn't die, he's gonna be in the legacy. Yeah. <laughs> like. So, like, next adventure, like, do we want to recruit the legendary Dan the Backslide? The legendary or... Dan Backslide. <laughs> the fucking See the legend. huge moth that landed on Mozilla's hair earlier today? How could I not? If you weren't going to say anything? I'm old! <laughs> <laughs> Trying around it for, like, an hour. Tell me a story before the embers die out. <laughs> <laughs> die of old age. I just want to spend time with a world where everything fits together nicely. Well, what do you want to hear? What the fuck? <laughs> do you tell me about yourself. Oh, the Fire King and the Raindrop. Uh, the Trickster Moon. There you go. Cadus told of how the moon used to be a dark hunk of stone until it tricked the sun into giving up some of its light. And the sun, as you would always suspected, can't stand the thought of anyone approaching a fraction of his brilliance. The moon knew that a fair fight was out of the question. So, while the sun was distracted, the moon fled over the horizon, drawn by a team of fireflies. And to this day, they take refuge in the night sky, shining where the sun will never find them, giving their blessings to those who move swiftly through the shadows. And then they kissed. Cadence, despite being one year older than Darloff, is aging quite gracefully. <laughs> Darloff looks like shit, dude! <laughs> Darloff became like 60 at 40. Oh, what the fuck? There was a. I didn't notice the melding right there. Whatever. If. Oh, oh, oh. Uh. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Before you attack with Mazala, get her next to the welding. Don't get that sweet flanking damage. Okay. Bunga bunga. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Her smug fucking face, like holding that axe. <coughs> Can't steal fire. Who is she the kid of? She's the kid of Eerie. And? I don't know! <laughs> Eerie just fucked sometime! Oh, hi. I, I guess you just no longer were hidden. I didn't expect it to try and run away, Jesus fuck. Here, if you can, if you can get that butler, uh, can fuck that butler, right? It's big. Butt fuck butler. that butt. Like that. Yeah, like that. Uh, actually, oh baby, uh, hold on, we we might be onto something here. Ooh, mama. And then... Oh! Fuck on the four. Up. God 
God, he looks horn awful. Wisdom. <laughs> I could give him wisdom. Uh. Uh, backslam. Every other turn knocks an enemy up to up to six tiles away, dealing four damage, one damage for each armor. Yeah, that one's okay. Yeah. Wisdom could be good. It just makes... Uh, you remember that thing that made... Uh, How old is he? I mean, it'll only get better the longer he sticks around. That's true. After another check... Yeah, let's just get wisdom. <laughs> Snake stone sash. Firefox again. Well, Zilla Firefox. Firefox. Oh no, not more watchmen. No, what do you mean, dude? <laughs> uh so where are they? You wanna secure that then? Yeah, we can secure it. You're fucking fast as fuck, boy. <laughs> that is true. Look at how fast it is. There he Batman is. Batman backslide! He's got a tiny ass crossbow. <laughs> He's a loser, dude! Uh, Dan's ranged attacks have plus zero damage, plus zero one strength, and start fires. Fires can spread onto <laughs> What the fuck, dude? I think through shot, right? Yeah, that could be an idea. Yeah, that could be. That could be something. <laughs> we have Dan backslide. Why do we have Dan backslide in this fucking party? He's going to get old. He's going to get crusty. He's going to have a kid. He's going to fall in love, maybe. He's going to fuck. He's going to potentially fall in love. I don't want Dan Backslide to find love. Uh, <laughs> that's fucked. Um, <laughs> Baron, that's fucked. Baron, that's fucked. You want them to meet up with, uh, with Jimothy and Eerie? Yeah, I think so. Alright. Uh, yeah, there we go. Completed. Oh, time for, time pie. for pie. What do we find? Ooh, a tier two staff. That's a good one. Fang axe, fuck, fuck stick. stick. Uh, I guess just replace Ellen Swines. Yeah, King Blaster. Yeah, that's just. And then a broke of chivalry. Um, alright. Um, we want to just give that to. I guess Firefox Mozilla? again? Yeah. Mozilla? Because you we got the, hey, you got the Fang Axe Fox stick. Yeah. The Fang Axe Fox stick, dude. Uh, we could have our, our trio scout out the next spot. The, yeah, right there. <laughs> the Neanderthal bog. <laughs> the Neanderthal fuckers. The Neanderthal bog. <laughs> God, Dorloff looks like shit! <laughs> he looks He's still, awful. We have a fucking we have a fucking displayed in Technicolor fucking adventuring party here with green ass Dan Backslide and blue. Ass <laughs> That's Dorloff. the cult of personality right here. Yeah. We have Dan Backslide. They like of course one you have fourth. blue skin and pronouns. <laughs> we have blue skin and pronouns, and then one fourth goblin. Yep. Oh god. You want them to fight? What's going on here? Yeah. Yeah. But make sure they're all together. Cool. Hey, another thing to fight. Let's fight it. Attack! Lord of renowned mystic. There's have been some dramatic tales from the dinner. I'm old now, by the way. <laughs> Tale of growing up. <laughs> eh? I think Draven wasn't dramatic. It's just something your mother's friends did. Late for you could trace your whole family tree within a few miles. Now that seemed far fetched. Can you imagine sleeping in the same house for a whole your whole life? You're boring, man. <laughs> <laughs> Agreed. Absolutely. <laughs> Fucking died. That would be what Darloff would say. Absolutely. Uh, Absolutely if you're a fucking dweeb. Fucking loser. If you spend enough time out here with the brand, band of yours, you start, oh, brand flicks. You start, you forget that. Bra what? Uh, 
Uh, you start forgetting, all right. Anyways, when's the early bird special? <laughs> you're like, but you're like forty. <laughs> he's like fifty. What is he? He's fifty like three. <laughs> He's 54. He's, He's 54. I know Cadis is a year older than him. I know. I mean, Cadis oh, looks fine. Him. I, what is it? It's a compass. <laughs> I, I you know how to use a compass, right? I can't fucking read. Cadis and <laughs> Darloff and Mozilla Firefox found it, fell in love. Oh, uh. that'd be awful. <laughs> You didn't have a neck for it. Silver compass talisman. Okay. What I mean, the melee fuck? Oh! Melee accuracy? Okay. Mozilla's trying to, like, rack up to be kind of a fucker. We just, we literally just need that thing where the more you infuse this shit, the stronger you get. And then she's fine. She's got it in the bag. Maybe, ha. Uh, if we knew. Ooh. Leaf Spirit. I could have Mozilla run up to it, but, uh... It'd be hard to beat whatever the... To beat to the, uh... Fuck, fuck stick Fang. Yeah, I can have Cadis grab it just so we can unlock a new weapon. Oh, you got it. Oh, I was hoping it would give, like, a second, like, option for, uh... You re replace the axe, why not? Like, we, we haven't unlocked leaf axes yet, and at least I haven't. Yeah, sure. Stunt damage, less stunt damage, but what is that? Some effect grants two temp HP to the hero. You know, that's not bad! That's not bad? Put, put it on there. Ouch. I understand the risks. Here, here, here's, here's an idea. There's nothing back here, is there? I'm pretty sure this is the last of them. Yeah. Most likely. Get her. Oh. Getting away. Fucker. Oh! <laughs> you want to know what the picture shows up? One of the pictures that shows up for Dan Backside Roman, and I absolutely fucking hate it. Uh, uh, just send it to me. When I look up Dan Backside, it's. Oh, God damn it, this is fucking. There we go. Oh, yeah, it's that one. I love that. <laughs> I need to have Dan backslide as like an emo on my on my Twitch stream. <laughs> Igneous knee knee pads, bonus damage. Bonus damage. We can give, give it to Dan to... backslide. Uh... We could give it to Dan backslide, <sighs> or we could give it to like Darloff or Cadis. Let's give it to let's give it to Darloff, right? He's earned it. He's old. <laughs> He's earned it. He's blue. He's blue. 
<laughs> what a loser. We have immediately another battle to go to. <laughs> summer tides, summer colors, the moth rose, and I'm heading down the mountain if you stay if you want. Wait, is that? Yeah, that is me. That is Jimothy. Morning, morning, see. Something like a fire in your voice. Everything alright? Who is it? Hey, you're a friendly face that changed. Uh, uh, your friendly face just changed, but isn't it Jimothy? All in my gear up these switchbacks like an ox. Also, I'm on fire now. Look at you, Ow. like a torch alive! Holy fuck! Uh, among us. So you noticed. Good. Hey, we're here for the ugly work. The cultists. Heard they were under Solera Lumberyard in the valley. But the same thing these people in the lumberyards are getting driven out. Yeah, what? Jimothy, you remember my husband. Husband now, is it? Yeah, you're too late. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the home smells like six kinds of sage. Only uh, ask for my hand if you believe that. I've got two. <laughs> Why wouldn't you believe it? <laughs> well, let's first the place. Well, let's first the place up. Since you're uh, you were, you were last th this way, how far is good at the digging and sawing and building and all? Jimothy's been talking you up as some uh, talking up as some apothecary. It runs in my family, you could say. Medicine for illness, treatments for pain, shri uh, sh sh shrining unctions and oils for other bunctions and goils. Functions and, and functions. And, and I married functions. this twink. You'll boast about it, see? What I'm saying is the worst than Lance Lance nowadays. Sorry if we're intruding. Can you, you can give me space if you need it? Shut the fuck up. No. <laughs> no, it's, we lost his sister to a landslide this time. Uh, this time last year. It was just foraging down the hill, and the, and the wind was high. Rainy spring, you know. Yeah, that's a rough one. Yeah, not actually you two. <laughs> we, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> it's not about my sister. The low, uh, the low villages need healing hands, supplies, but cultists control the slopes now, and it's just getting worse. And we're not capable of fighting them off. So I'm saying, if they can, if they can, folks will climb up up to us. We need to be stocked and ready. Can't fault you for good sense, but Morny disagrees. I'm guessing. Stop trying to be impartial, that's uh, what good healers ask is the wounded to drag their gnawed on bodies to their door. I've got to go down there and help them. Jimothy, I'm seeing a couple of ways we could go. I'm going to do a little extra recon. I guess, Eerie, I, you, you know these people too? I'll just be a little bit. I'm just not sure what magical power you think you wield that'll keep you safe. You're softer than me, dear, and I wouldn't mind. I, I wouldn't like my chances. I need you too. I don't really listen to this. It's been a strain on both of you, I can see, and I'm sorry it's got you fighting. Well, it's not really your business either, eh? Well, at least we've come to root out those muck lovers, and we will. We'll make the lowlands safe. You serious? Jimothy's a warrior. I mean, we'll support you, but we're not even militia trained. Aside from water and bandaging, we how far stop? They're willing to do what's needed, no matter what. It might cost them. We need to follow their example. Oh, this is Jimothy's business. It's up to you. Uh, your hands will be needed. Don't waste them on our work. Uh, a risk should be worthwhile. You need strength to swing an axe. A willingness to sacrifice is most often where strength is born. Uh, what the fuck? I guess... 
Wait, am I asking them to go into battle with me? I think so. I think that's what they're bickering about is is whether like Morty comes with you or Morty and her husband comes with you or not. I think they shouldn't have Which, to. They'll be I fine. feel like they uh, we're I mean like yeah, Jimothy is capable alone even. Yeah. Plus we got like what? Uh got Eerie and uh whoever the fuck the other redhead's name is. <laughs> Orn Ornesty. I actually forgot her name. I actually forgot her name. What's her name? Uh, Ellen Swine. Ellen Swine. What a stupid ass name. I think Dan Backslide is better. <laughs> Dan Backslide has history to it. That's true. Do not insult the name of the Backslides. They were a reckless fool then. Hey, I know how it feels. Sometimes the hardest thing is to listen to sense when it sounds like it. It sounds like cowardice. Arnie, you're brave. So brave and so brilliant. And look, if I didn't love you so much, I wouldn't be sad holding you out of this. Fine, dear. I just, I just hope well. well. The thing is to now to give you all the aid we can, right? Jimothy, here, let's figure out what you need. The apothecary and her husband. Excuse me, I have a cold. I'm Jimothy and Eerie, the tonics and recipes to dispute them. Along with some other scarce supplies for Jimothy in particular, the medicine he loves to be able to last in the How do you to keep his body him his mind sound? After the coming battle, Morty and Hanton are seeing the burning leaves to the Valley people. Their last name is just C. C. That's what it'd be like if you and I were married. <laughs> just <laughs> no <Skip> response. <laughs> <laughs> <Just> nothing. <coughs> Plus six <coughs> tenacity. What is tenacity? <coughs> Come. Come. It makes him come more. <laughs> he got cock medicine. Does it come flames? Armor and warding. Oh, they're deepest. Okay. This shouldn't be too bad. And we got Dan Backslide! Dan Backslide. And I need you. <laughs> and you gotta fucking bore you. <laughs> what? That's right, Dan Backslide hurt you. <laughs> Remember the name. Remember the name, because I won't. Oh. Ow, you just hurt Dan Backslide. You'll pay for that. Eat shit. No, Dan! You stole the wolf call! <laughs> <laughs> I'll steal it! No, Dan! The wolf call! <laughs> You bastard! Dan. You, God damn you! God damn you all to hell! Okay, Jimmy. Okay, Jimmy. A child. I don't can. Double kill. Dad! 
man, you son of a bitch! <laughs> And I need you. <laughs> it's like really fucking extreme music. Damn backslide. Damn backslide. <laughs> the joke for the rest of the fucking stupid ass campaign. Take back slide. Take back slide. He didn't even do that. He just take back slide. He's just See, so he's just so into his own like stealth. <laughs> he just fucks up his stealth. No, every it's time. it's it's fucking like the 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 scene from the Emperor's New Groove where Kronk's like sneaking around he's like well but <laughs> um, so uh, oh, accuracy. I want that on Cadus, actually. Some range shots are a sure bit thing. iffy. And I need you. It's surprising how quickly I can go from fighting for my life to back, uh, back to everything feeling normal. Just cut down a pile of monsters. You get to feel however you want to feel. At least her little friend is back to normal. Where's our? Where's my daughter? <laughs> where's Dan Backslide? <laughs> <laughs> Why does it do that, anyways? What? That digging. Why well, can't a character just dig a little without some human passing judgment? Wow, she's <laughs> attached to that thing, though. A dollar. At the time it wore itself. Oh look, it's got some. Looks like it got something. Some of those mushroomy bits and send it back. Yeah, get those anymore. That's something else. A coin? What type of coin I recognize though, it looks old. Bit of a theme with you, isn't it? Who knows where it came from? Better than other, better than another dead mouse, anyways. Well, that's cute. Doesn't do, doesn't anything. do anything. Give it to Dan, he's greedy. <laughs> and that'll be perfect if I can coin tell Money! <laughs> Money! <laughs> Money! I'll steal shit! Fuck you! Fuck you, you fucking dick. Um, you want to secure the place? Uh, might as well. Well, who, who's up there? Cadis, uh... Cadis, Kat Darloff, and uh, Mozilla. Man, Firefox. Oh, and Ellen's mine. <sighs> uh... We have to go through the mountain range at some point. Uh, where's the mountain range? This right here. Oh, uh, we, we have to go through it, or can we go around it? No, we have to, we have to clear out the Morthagi. And there's no around. Like we've discovered, we've scouted all this shit. If there was well, wait, what, wait, what about like what's Crash Peaks? That's mountains, dude. Oh, they're impassable. Oh, fuck. So we'll have to build a pass here. Yeah. Uh. Do we want Darloff there then? Because he's got wisdom. Uh. Well. How you? How's this? Darloff has wisdom. Send Cadis. Cadis can just fucking sprint there. That's fair enough. So, okay, who's going to start on the pass, then? I guess just everybody who isn't Darloff and, uh... And Cadis? Uh, yeah, no, Darloff and, uh, Mazala. Uh, Darloff and Maserati are going to stay behind. Everybody else is going to work on the passage. Okay. Oh, hold on. They're, they haven't started work. Are they waiting for everyone else? You just you just picked Cadis. Oh, whoops. Yeah. My bad. There we go. I don't oh, like I, the wardrobe. I don't want a wardrobe. That I can deal with our butler. 
Yeah. I can deal with the butler. I'll be That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> All right, what's the item? Crow feather talisman, more warding. I'll get it to like Elm Swine. Yeah, why not? Honestly, none of the guys that we fought so far deal that much magic damage. No. Fewer still shred it. Oh, hold on. They need to be moving. Oh, yeah, they gotta get going. Uh, do they want to help with uh, securing over here? They might as well. There's literally nothing for else for them to do. Okay, find an item? Uh, yeah. It is, it is Darloff. Armin Forrest, Ellen Swine, and Jimothy have an idea. Ellen Swine and Jimothy? When when is Cadius gonna get a thing, huh? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> well, he might as well. Yeah. Okay, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm glad that gets a giggle out of you every time. <laughs> it feels of Serana. This is old symphony with melodies that rise and fall from those who listen. I was a grown bull for rabbits, anyways. You know, trained ear may notice when they go off uh, slightly off key. What's the fourth quail I've I've seen this week? Does that mean a bad harvest or uh, uh, I was never good at omens? Shut up. <laughs> he's, not, <laughs> he's not from around here. Who makes you say that? Make you track of them all. Wrong tail feathers. See, ones from here are the reddish tails. This one's just go gray. Nothing wrong with going gray. S says the 50 year old this is a 50 year old who can't go gray because he has fire hair because <laughs> he's fire <laughs> gray tails are are from hills of serana flowers rabbits and quails all coming from it something's wrong in hills of serana you're getting that from some animals it's all right there in front of you you simply have to pay attention fuck you <laughs> <laughs> I pay attention to who needs talk and who'd rather be left alone. I pay attention to the force of my strikes and whether it's enough to keep us alive. I'll pay attention to those things. You pay attention to the quails and together we'll be unstoppable. How's that sound? Are you propositioning me? Sounds perfect. What's going on? <coughs> <coughs> It'll be they could have another pair of the eyes and ears and our nose. Sure, why not? For sure. Your butt's all better. Your Stop bring Dan can, do should we bring Dan back slide? Um yeah, why not? He's a good boy. He's Is not, he though? He's not a good boy, but he's good for it. If you pay him. Yeah, bring him with. Fuck it. <coughs> Alright. Oh, they get to go all the way across the world. Uh, well, they're coming here. Um, Do we want to prepare some defenses for when they get here? I mean, we're already here, so we may as well. We could finish the pass. We're almost done. Yeah, we could. And then we couldn't do the defenses. And so what? I click on this and then hit... Oh, we have to secure the site first. Ooh, oh, fuck. Uh-oh. Uh, uh do, we want Dan? do we want Dan again? Yeah, maybe. Uh, we... So what? Everybody who isn't Ellen Swine and Jimmy? May as well. Dan, help us! <laughs> Dan's like, oh, fuck, I gotta go back. <laughs> Secure site complete. We may have enough time to get, like, a level one defense in. Some block in. Do, do you want to give that to Dan? Uh, yeah, might as well. Dan's knees. Prepare defense. We could probably get some level one defenses in. Um. 
That was way too quick. We could have done two. Ah, whatever. Honestly, do we just take the fight to them? Do we just, like, sprint up and be like, yo, what up? Fight. No, we might as well just... Because if we fight there, we'll have some NPCs to okay, gotcha. help, too. Why does the tier 2 defenses take forever, too? What? What the fuck is going on? Wait, what's going on? Why aren't you... You guys are here out there. Something's fucky. Okay, there. The story continues. <laughs> Your line is. Colin. Oh, sorry. It's fucking someone's texting me of all that time in the Zark. So I finally catch up to them. You know where all four raccoons ended up? First, right in front of the crook of the ground. You know, I've never known... You could have told me anything about Ellen Swine. Like, he was just like, oh yeah, like, can talk to animals. I would have believed it, because I don't know shit about her. So, hold on. I want to look at her fucking... her fucking... I don't know what the fuck... I think we just kind of made her, and co like, colored her, and, like, put her in. I think that's all She's we did. She's inhabited wild heart, broken heart. I think this is a wild heart hook yeah. here. Huh. Come. So then what? It was a grandmother's tree. It was stolen pie. It wasn't worth the kind of trouble. I got there as fast as I could. And therefore you're here to tell the story. And they ask around the hills of Strana. People don't hesitate to point them to the Sennar Bounds farmstead. It's because the weird stuff happens to me. Not all of it. Not all of it. He says as he grabs him with his flaming hand and scorches him alive with the burning hands of Sauron. <laughs> uh, all the weird shit happens to me. No, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it doesn't. <laughs> you call me a liar? Yeah. Yeah. Listen, my family's been here a long time. We tamed this land. You understand? No, oh, you didn't. No, they weren't. <laughs> <laughs> Got some cornbread here. It's not fancy. Yes, it is. <laughs> Those Tetlas have moved in. Mortimer, uh, Mortimer is what you call them. The Skull Guys. At first, I only hear them at night. After a while, they scatter into the trees, and then they saw me. We're only... They're getting bolder. They're buttoned up against the northern fields. They are there for the corn. Oh no, they're here for the corn bread. Which is the north edge of the field. It's just it's high enough to It's fight. This could be hard. Well, you never know. That's true. Jimothy is pretty strong. This sapling with surprising delicacy. They're planting trees. Sinister trees. Completely normal trees. Can't, can't complain about more trees. <laughs> yeah, well, why not? Can't complain about more trees. I don't know. Do we trust more Thoggy? I I think generally speaking, no. But I do want to see where it goes. I mean, think of it like this. What, what did we save a while ago? A Draven? We could trust that guy. <laughs> Uh, I don't like it. Uh, if you say so. I just don't like it. Also, considering that Morthog, you're the main enemy in this campaign. Right, yeah. This is close to people. Let's roll them down that hill. Right behind you. Pickle. Pickle. Ah! Oh, they're it's just only spectics. Three I will burn them all. Jesus Christ, Jimmy. I'm so good at this Idiot. game. Idiot. <laughs> Imagine Jimothy oh. just like howling after every time he kills something oh. and everyone's telling him to shut the fuck up. Did 
Jimmy, what do you even have that sword for? Uh, for fun. Uh, pick, pick my teeth. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy's level five. Um. I kind of like Tinker, I think. I don't know what to pick out of these, actually. <laughs> I don't know. I, let's let's upgrade Wolf Call, actually. He's basically like a caster now, so I don't know. Pretty much. Feather Steel Talisman. Who wants speed? Um, put it on Darloff. Think so? Yeah. That's pretty good speed on Darloff, yeah. G give him some fucking schmoove. I think that was all, huh? It was while patching scratches of skin and gear. Thing emerges there than a few squirrels. Sent back to the farmhouse in Darkness Falls. Even Maybe the, the tree. tree's there, huh? I don't know, there's something loathsome about pulling out a baby tree. Besides, this isn't our home. Just to leave those decisions to someone who knows what, I, what it needs. And that means more cornbread and hot drinks for us. Said Jimothy. <laughs> yeah, I was like, I was like, all right, if, if you want it. Um, fuck it. <laughs> while you were saying that, <coughs> while you're saying that, I was looking at his fire foot and I was like, man, everything is just fucked. <laughs> My foot is on fire. Everything is ruined. Um, um, arches is good. We had that on Jay, unless you want naturalist, since she's a fucking druid, I kinda, apparently. I kind of want to try naturalist a little bit. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> go, go we help got him. Cause. We got incursion to stop, too. Yeah, go help him. You want to try building tier three, even though I don't think it'll work? It won't work. There you are. Later. Yeah. All right, Dan, backslide. This is all up to you. This is all up to you, dude. <laughs> Kadis is just like, I'm like 50, dude. I can't do this anymore. <laughs> Kadis is like, ah, I need you know. All right, so what do we do? I'm glad you're here. Darloff, I'm glad you're here. You've only been here for like a while. Do we want to go time. with Dan's plan? Dan's the man he, with the yeah, plan? Yeah, let's do Dan. He's, Stay hidden to the last moment. He's a new boy. Let him do it. Dan's the man with the plan. <coughs> you begin a great play in our heroes flanking attacks as combat deal plus one damage. Holy shit. It worked. Dan's plan actually worked. Dan. Dan, you did it. Dan. He's Dan fucking backslide. He's Dan fuck. Dan fuck slide. Dan. I'm the leader you need, dead back slide! Okay, I thought one of the civilians was named Hadia Wild and it was freaking me out for a moment. You were just like, uh, 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 uh. I think Dan and Cadis got this. You can probably have the beefy, the beefcake spread out and go find the rest uh, of them. Oh, we'll put Darloff outside, yeah. Especially since he's Let's... fucking invisible. I gave Mozilla Firefox the wrong fucking class. No, actually, that's not our fault because, like, literally, she was born this. She was born a, a, a mystic. Here he could open that door up top. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot the door. 
<laughs> ha, idiot. Dumbass. Stupid fuck. <gasps> I'll run about. Don't say fuck. Say drugs. Say drugs. Uh, Okay, to me. <sighs> Why? I think it's funny. It's funny. It's funny, Colin. Uh, if you don't want to use the volley of arrows, I got something to use it on. Uh, you go ahead then. Yeah. Dance at fire. Get All it, because right. there's fire up here. <laughs> Dance at fire, how hunky of him. How hot. Dancing fire is the only thing that can get me hot anymore. Uh, I might need some more backup down here. All of a sudden. Uh, with the, uh, butler? Yeah. He's got a lot of temp HP. Uh, okay. Um, I'm gonna send Mozilla up to assist, but... Um, Darloff will be on the way. Firefox. No, it's just a spectator. Have no fear, Darloff here. Darloff is here. Anyways. Anyway, Darloff fuck invincible. <laughs> German cloud knows his shit. You're not supposed to run from Darloff. Darloff, fuck your ass, and then you scream and shit and cry. Okay. <laughs> Darloff, chill. <laughs> He's bad. Release flight. What? <laughs> Cadus, who the fuck says that?
I'm gonna have to borrow Dan in the back here for a moment. Ah, uh, Dan's feeling inspired. <laughs> Just pass the fire throw. Fire Kill place. him! Kill him. Live, laugh, love. Fucker! <laughs> Live, laugh, love. Away. <laughs> Live, laugh, love. I should have named her Axe that. Uh. Fuck it, more wisdom? Yeah, why not? We're gonna speed run this shit. No, dude. We already know a wardrobe that we no. can't stop. <laughs> no, dude. No, dude. All right, I I think we just gotta get to the downs. What the about downs these of two? Methuselah. Oh, there's literally nothing they can do. They can't even fight with us. They can gather here. She's getting away. Fucker. This equipment's not up to st Okay. What? Sure. Eerie and Cadence of all people. Okay. Is this your hook or mine? I have no idea. This is Cadence's hook. This is Cadence's hook. Thank God. Finally. See what I mean? Most of it's garbage. Worse than, usual. Uh, worse than useless because it takes up space. You know, Eerie... You might be right. Storm full of used, cast off, and recovered equipment. Uh, uh, Not an inspiring assortment at all. Said Chaos. <laughs> you know what, Eerie? <laughs> <laughs> you so you think of this some help? And you know where to find it? No. no. <laughs> this is a fucking stupid joke. <laughs> Mario keeps most of himself. <laughs> Certainly, the metal merchants know. So, reputation means anything these days. That's exactly who we, who we need. Thinking back to my first battle. Clumsy feet, no armor, little actual skill, and not even a real weapon. Yeah, How did you I were find the nerve? Back then? <laughs> Wow, is that, is that an old joke? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're right. It's wrong, we'll be. <laughs> uh, do it. I'm, I'm bark. No, no time like the present. We're not Dan? bringing Dan. We're not bringing Dan. J let's do. Let's do Cadis and. Cadis and Firefox? You're no, it has Mozilla? to be eerie. No. Uh, it has to be eerie as the other one. Um. I think we could just do Cadis and eerie. Like, what, what could possibly they're be the out there? They're, they're of the first three, yeah, so. They have to go Dan? all the way why back. Is Dan always, why does Dan always want to come along? Like, it's like, can I come? Like, Dan, stay! <laughs> Dan, stop. Um, I don't. Uh, I, I don't I kinda, like the butler with extra health. Yeah, because 25% HP is actually a lot on the butler. I think plus one uh, damage is fine. The batch, yeah, that guy doesn't really actually hurt that much. It's scuppy. Plot. Downs. I mean, we can get the whole boy. We can get the whole squad here if we want. Yeah, the whole boy. <laughs> we can get the entire what's with boy. The, what's with the Mark Quarry? That's always like where everyone needs to go. Yeah, right. The story continues. We can. Ugh. I mean, Marcio's forge isn't particularly hard going. Turns out, make, make an appoint Cadis and Eerie on their way. 
Some forest meets them on their hills, branches laced with black warblers. The camp of the path. I distinctly remember the moment I decided. Stars aren't spirits. They're ideas. Ideas once had by people, or even dogs, crows, monsters. What? Ideas we died with, risen from cold ears to shine as cosmic light. Now just glimmers of Cadus? what if... What? Are your ears cold, Cadus? No, don't, don't talk to me. Mm. Then stop talking out loud. <laughs> the morning they arrive at their destination, not talking about Cadus's cold-ass ears. Mario? Mar Mario? Holy shit, he's ripped. Holy fuck, look at this, this specimen. Unit. <coughs> I'm Cadus. Oh, my name, that's fine. You come with the custom? I'm Cadus, this is Eerie. We're looking to get some weapons done. Solid pieces and handsome ones. Easy for learners to love. I am handsome, yes. You I will break your body in two. Like, like you, five you talk six. fucking weird. Hermph. Hermph. Their plans are made with tea on the table, my mother's wisdom. Explaining who they are, and it takes just a short while. The tea, earthy as the face, uh, with overly sweet gobs of gum and honey. <laughs> Really be doing with be contributing to the safety of the people, our land, our lives, everyone. Okay, it's just like gently scoots his tea across the table, just like, ah, I'm okay. <laughs> I, I'm good. I don't need this. For a while since I've asked for a volume task like that, since you're appealing to my altruism, I'll assume you have nothing to trade. Well, not nothing. Minus 10 retirement age? No, I can't do that. We can give him some ingots. We, we can got give plenty him some ingots. ingots. How, <laughs> let me help with the forge. Oh! All of a sudden we're under attack? Did, did something else happen? No. <laughs> no, just like... Because these, it, these it, Draven just showed up after we said, Hey, we got some ores. Oh, oh. One, one second, let me read it out. Because you skipped forward, apparently. No, I didn't. It literally... I hit, like, we Let brought some ores and... Rare, huh? Let me be the judge. Mario the Smith examines the ingots they brought. <laughs> well, it's no pit tracking, I'll give you that. Alright, then, these beauties included. There's one more errand you can do, and we'll call it a fair trade. What the fuck? Which is how they ended up rooting for seldom-seen mushrooms in the deep woods. Why does he need mushrooms? Is he just gonna get high? There's something pale growing by that rock face. Welder caps, or else it's stones or toadstools. They'd been at it a whole week now and only found three, one of which Eerie lost to a pretty aggressive squirrel. Sorry, <laughs> squirrels freak me out. What the f- They reached the rock face, a sharp change in elevation that splits the forest. And there, huddled in the damp earth, welder caps in great number. Potent fumes rise out from them, a smell close to a wet beast. Hey, don't laugh, but can you check if that squirrel's around? Um, grar. But as they move to collect the trove, a raggly cry rings out. Another assailant drops from the heights. Wow, three of them. <laughs> Hugh Bangers and Flash Neutron. Flashbang. Flash code again. Got him. Okay. Because she's got the thing that hurts people. Yeah, if you come adjacent to her, she hurts you. Shield. I. No one needs this. No one needs a shield. Salvage. Ingot. 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 A tier two maze? A tier two maze, alright. <laughs> we can give it to Dan. Uh, e I, I kind of hate it, but you know what? Why not? I <laughs> kind hate knife. the idea of Dan backslide with a fucking club. <laughs> <laughs> he replaces, replaces knife. Fuck it. Father's money. <laughs> That's his name of his That's maze. That's the name of his maze. A great axe? 
Give it to Ellen. No, wait, uh, give it to Mazala. <laughs> the only difference is it's bigger. <laughs> what the fuck? She's the wrong class for this fucking weapon. <laughs> oh, fuck me, this is funny. They have been scouts, let's not waste time. I'm surprised they tried that. They collect the brute of fish brute. You know, if we were ordinary folks foraging the woods, we most likely had died back there. Yeah, so? Foraging forge welcomes the back. I'll see your hull. At night, the man sautés these rare mushrooms in butter and garlic. The whole house fills with the aroma of first acrid and nutty. Nut. There's truly nothing better. <laughs> cooking them down, uh, cooking them doesn't does make them easier in the tummy. And in case you were worried about sleeping in close quarters, in case you were shitting, crying and shitting and farting, and they go on their way with the new weapons and tow. So we just get new weapons instead of like retirement age or something. I have no idea. <laughs> You don't tell me anything about the stars again. Uh, no. Thinking about my friends. Shut up. Well, it's just that for a long time I felt like there was something expected of me. A lot of it came from my own thing. My there vision is. of the... Well, anyway. I was supposed to make some kind of a breakthrough. One day, I thought. Have Good a moment of truth. Shut up. <laughs> you were. You have. You mean you. You mean you have it. The like like Cadis is getting like actually mad. He's just, shut up. Why you bring you? I, I was supposed to have some sort of breakthrough, Stop. like trying to figure out some sort of great formula, and like there's this worried face on like Eerie's face. Like, you mean you haven't yet? <laughs> <sighs> you just magically turn into a perfect ver a version of yourself. Yeah. Well, it's never like that, is it? Changes aren't so sudden in people. Unless I mean, you're I'm fucking perfect. Unless you're fucking uh Jimothy. Jimothy, yeah. Fucking fire ass hand. That was his <laughs> jacket hand, you know that? Really? Yeah, it was. He must be miserable. Growth's not for us to accomplish alone, so I'm glad for my friends. It helped me become what I was supposed to become. Be become. Walked with me. Anyways, uh <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I don't mention it. In Cyberpunk 2077, you can become... Well, three legacy points! Ooh. Oh, and baby. No oh, you got your retirement age. There you go. Thank you. <laughs> um... Um... I guess we'll do archery. Okay. Or heroism. Heroism is kind of cool, though. <coughs> hmm. Up to you. It's your character. Yeah. I'll try, actually, you know what, I'm gonna try upgrading Thornfang, because I really want to know if it works at range to two. Alright. Alright, so geez. we're fighting this here, too, but we do want everyone. Oh, well, they literally can't get everyone. Well, you know, they don't count. They can, like, they can, here. They can, like, move in together. Oh, uh, they can, okay. <laughs> Sure. I mean, that's literally the only other place that can be, like, scouted, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Okay, Jimmy. Attack. Almost a pollen water wheel, aren't we? Look at Darloff standing next to Jimothy <laughs> like he's fucking making fun of him. <laughs> <laughs> Almost a pollen water wheel, aren't we? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Fuck me. 
Oh, look at me. I'm Jimothy. I got fucking fire fingers. Fucking idiot. Stupid dumbass. <laughs> fucking idiot. Look at me. I got the power. Uh, <laughs> I'm like made of fire. Oh, look at me. I'm so special. Right looks right. Heels are tough, but rich. Money! <laughs> He's so happy. We get have the land from there. They're terrified. <laughs> <laughs> it was <coughs> steeper than it needed to be. Quite a view, though. I'll say that. Shut the fuck up, Jimothy. Fuck you. <laughs> oh, what's this? <laughs> <laughs> it's a rock, you idiot. Oh. <laughs> what a find! Don't be worried, who else will find? Well, let it be. Let's head down. These are valuable. <laughs> Is Dan 40, gonna take an egg? It's forty-six percent, but I don't care. Dan has to take the egg. He has to get it. Oh no, <laughs> Dan! Wait, he did it. Did he? Yeah, because if he fails, he falls and loses like half his health. Hold on. Now, how should I? I guess this old flower sack. Dan, it's here. It's about to be... It's a giant bird. <laughs> Hurry up! Faster! In the bag, little buddy. Duck! Then it's to scramble down safely the rest of the way. That night, you cooking something? What do you think? The egg? You didn't. Do you think I would cook my prize? You can't have your egg and cake or... Anyway. Anyway, no, just keeping him warm, my little crag eagle. So he's got a he's got a bird now. I uh, guess so. Oh, there's a wardrobe right there. Oh yeah. Well, you know it's better Ooh, be right here. Look at that damage. Okay, I'm gonna put Dan in a really bad position because he's greedy. Go get him. Dan, Dan, the gambling man. Tier 2 <laughs> fire mace. I can't. Oh my god. No, I'm, I'm doing a. I'm doing a. Oh, it, it, but it's tier 2. <coughs> oh, fuck. I'm, I'm giving him the crossbow. Alright. What's it going to be called, though? The runabout. The runabout. The runabout. Okay, Jimmy. Okay, Jimmy. Shut the fuck up. You love it every time I say it. Fuck you. Okay, Jimmy. Okay, Jimmy. Bitch. Oh, look at me, I'm Jimmy. <laughs> That is so fucking cool. Dan has to steal the egg! He has to steal it! I hate the I, I hate Dan with a fucking mace. <laughs> the fucking mace in his hands. <laughs> Jeez, like, I'll be really sneaky about stealing this. And he just clubs a guy. Ah, that's how Burning Arrow works. I understand. Oh. It's you select a target for Burning Arrow or, or Burning Sword, and then you pick a thing for them to hit. Oh. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> Alright, get to uh, Elm Swine out there. I'll just have Darla. Start off taking it. Oh, going in the aura. That's right. Yeah, I understand the risks. Put the fuck up. Like, I think if I interfuse with this, then I could do Blazing Sword. Pick Darloff and then pick the welding. 
That's interesting. That's actually looted. That's actually busted. Actually, like makes him attack another time. Yeah, you can attack twice in a turn. That's insane. Okay, Jimmy. Oh. Oh my clamps. Oh my dodge. Oh my womanhood. <laughs> <laughs> Protect this specimen, Dan Backslide. <laughs> you didn't like that I put me and pulled the mace out. <laughs> Wow. Okay, Jimmy. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Jimothy. Gun. Achievement unlocked. Who's cut rivals? Cutthroat competitors. Someone's a ri Who's rivals with who? Is Dan Backslide a rival with someone already? He just arrived! He just got here. Oh, he, wait, like, trigger literally... rival ability? Oh, yeah, watch this five times in a single fight. What? Who? What? Who? Five Who times? A... Five. You're insane. <sighs> Jimmy, fucking kill him. Dan Backslide, relationships. He's a rival with Ellen Swine? Okay. Fate Tracer. Dueling Sword Tier 2. Who gets this? It's an artifact. Deals bonus damage on enemy turn. I'll give it to Dan Backslide. Uh. No? Uh... I don't know who to give this to. You don't like him having a mace. You can give it... You can... Uh... Yeah, no, fuck, I don't, uh, you could give it to Ellen Swine, she doesn't have a melee, I don't know, dude. <laughs> She's got a stick. I know she has a stick, but like, she has, she could swap, dude. <laughs> I don't fucking you know, just don't like, Why don't you want to give Dan Backslide anything nice? I gave him the maze, alright? I gave him the maze, you didn't like it, the idea of giving him the maze. <laughs> He's after the last battle. Don't really scrap some Wait, was that him? Put yourself something nice. I think things are quiet down for a while. Oh, oh great. Oh, great. Now what? What do you think it is? I don't know, but if it's the end of the world, I'll come back and warn you. <laughs> More foggy. So, we have to go somewhere else now? Jack spat out. Investigate the light. Oh, it's in the Baladusa Forge. Oh. Alright, who's going there? Uh, this is the final fight of the chapter. When this fight is over, the chapter is in. Make sure you're ready. Uh, who the fuck is going to show up there? I, I guess know. I guess Cadus and Eerie. I mean, at this point... Darloff's, Darloff. Darloff's probably gonna show up. And then, I guess, Firefox and... Dan? Uh... What if it's just those four and the other three go scout out the thing? I mean, sure, I guess. Okay, and then... Scout is... Yeah.
chooses to rest. Does she sleep, dream? Is it a vision? A metaphor? Or is it the tortoise truly coming to speak to her? It's a tortoise! What the fuck? Of course you have, this pattern is everywhere. In the wind and the stars. The sea and the storm. The fire and the fur. <laughs> He's becoming Tommy Wiseau. We've always been here. We've always been here. We? We hold up the earth and the sky and the storm. We protect the fur and the water and the wheat. You should understand that and protect others also. One of us, can't you feel it? Are we she gonna turn her into a turtle? Oh, fuck! Do you wanna... Do you wanna turn her into yes! a turtle? Or what? Or try to throw out your lifetime's video throughout this task. Does that mean she's gonna live forever? I have no idea. She's gonna like have a like, lifespan of a tortoise or something? Can you imagine? Could you imagine living like a fucking turtle? That'd be crazy. Haha. <laughs> Anyways, yes, what do you think about my turtle, OC? He's 10 million now. years old. Maybe <laughs> <laughs> we'll discuss this matter further. Do I become a tortoise? This is for open for negotiation. It sounds like the cranes are all around. Out the world. Everywhere. Thoughts, thoughts, look. Be, be, be well, Ellen Swan. We'll be speak again one day. <laughs> hey, Ellen Swine. You've been napping on the job? No, I. Did you see a. That's a pretty cool tortoise shell pendant. You find it here? I'm having a strunk, by the way. <laughs> That's kind of a long story someday, I'll tell you. Wow, 0.7. You got more health. health. Wow, good job, idiot. Wow. Plus block. All right, do it. Oh, it's plus fifteen block. A lot. I want to build something here. We could build something on the turtle. Uh, heartwoods and fabrics. Um. Two heartwoods or provides hides and spell, spell threads. Uh, I'm not really thrilled by any of these. We could do hides and spell threads. Yeah. Get to work, Dan, you lazy fuck. Wow, that was fast. Ah, oh, too late, this is the battle. Through Fiona Spook Hill. Mozilla Firefox was there too. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, sure, after we bust our nuts getting here, right? now you disappear? Yeah, isn't this around where Aura's Forge is? What up? Old Magpie's got not to now. What up? You here? Well, what's the big idea here, anyway? Hello? Oh, <laughs> she's melted. What do you think? I don't know, I think, but I've got a weird feeling. I can tell you that. Apparently I'm, I'm Mozilla, by the way. <laughs> you are now. No sign of her inside. Crunch. Mm. Oh, it's Crunch Pop. the Beast Bandicoot. Reese's Puff! Reese's Puff! Reese's... I, I have a thing to, to link you that I I think you'll only partially understand, but I think maybe you'll think it's funny. Okay. Unless she's working on the roof. <laughs> Crunch the Beast Bandicoot. I'm glad you like Crunch the Beast Bandicoot. <laughs> okay. Oh fuck, Jimmy. Oh fuck, Jimmy. <laughs> oh fuck.
Mazla is ready to fucking throw hands, dude. I like that you respectively try calling her Mazla when her name is Mozilla Firefox. Maserati. Lamborghini. Mozzarella. Mozzarella Firefox. Mozzarella Firefox. Where'd that much watchman go? I almost said mozzarella. I hate you. <laughs> Fizzle spice. Okay, Jimmy. Okay, Jimmy. Fuck. Um... Bitch, that was 87%. Fuck. <laughs> Doesn't it frustrate you, Robin? Uh, dude, I'm, I'm getting XCOM so fucking hard. If there's any percentage that's like above 60%, my mind just like rounds up and goes, oh, that's basically 100%. And then I get fucking, and I get fucking livid whenever it actually doesn't work. I missed a 99% chance. I missed a hundred percent chance once in XCOM, man. <laughs> because, because fucking, well, one, because I have astronomically bad luck, and two, XCOM does fucking round up its numbers. So it's like 99.6% and I missed. <laughs> I remember you trying to show me XCOM for the first, or do you want to move Mozilla or me? Uh, oh, I guess I will. I'm voice here now, fuck it. I remember you showing me Mozilla, like, uh, <laughs> I remember you showing me XCOM for the first time a long time ago, like, as when we were, like, young. And you're like, dude, this is, like, really cool. You showed it to me, and you got, like, your squad fucked up. And you're like, wait, no, that's not... <laughs> wait, no. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, Jesus. Oh, they're all nice stun. Septic. It's a spice. Wardrobe, we need to find that. Well, it ain't over here, I can tell you that much. There's a batch bee over there. Well, there's a bitch over there. <laughs> Oh, you found a butt. Kind of there it is. There it is. There we are. Okay. That welding is 3 HP. Maybe if it's spawned, they have less health. And yeah, seems to be the shtick. 
you got anything to shred armor, Cadus has got the damage. It's the great axes. Um, Yuri can try. There's plenty of like wood out there, I believe. So just watch uh, Mozilla Firefox. Oh, uh, Darloff is kind of in a rough spot all of a sudden. He he'll be okay. Ooh. Oh, actually, look at this. We can get rid of the wardrobe. Oh, hey. If I just, like... Well, if I wasn't an idiot, and... Confused with the wrong thing. My bad. It's not that big a deal, I don't think. Oh, he's fine. Yeah. Oh, that's a bash me. Too big an issue. Here, I can get rid of the wardrobe. Actually, hold on. Come on, that would have been so cool. I got it. How many people has Kate has killed? Because I feel like I'm on a fucking roll. I don't know. We can check after this battle. This, <laughs> this chapter's done after this, so... Okay. Yeah. Let's see. Where did we find that, actually? I can I can take a look at it right now. Where did we find the what? Yeah, where did we, where did we find that? How many people he's fucking killed? Oh, it's in history. Monsters killed 31. Holy fuck. How many has Darloff has gotten? 32. All right. They're they're relatively even. How about Yuri? 28. Wow. They're they're all equally they're contributing. Kind of gamers. Get him. Fucker. I was about to fucking scream if there was more. Please give her the one that makes her stronger. Darloff will retire at the end of this chapter? No, dude. No, dude! Oh. Wait, why is he retiring and, like, Cadis isn't? Cadis is older. Darloff never fulfilled a quest, I don't think. Did he like not? His, uh, I don't think he ever got a hook. I'm pretty sure. No, I don't think he did. Damn, dude. You want to give this to Jimothy then? Maybe. Yeah, give it to... Yeah, give it to Jimothy. Jimothy the Q. Old Q. He's got the Indignance one. Yeah. I do like indignance. Yeah, let's do it. Sounding hills are four more days. There are no more thoggy sightings, but no sign of aura either. Why did Darloff all of a sudden say like, "Hey, you're gonna retire well, now"? Well, that's the thing. Like, yeah, yeah, it didn't say that, and uh, like any at any point other other than right now. So it must have been like on the way, like on on his way walking there. He decided. On the way there, he must have like got like a fucking cramp. And he's like, "I'm too old for this. I'm <laughs> I can't do no this more. anymore." <laughs> Unless you want to while away your years of peace in Nora's backyard, Grandma. Does it bother you though? 
all this nonsense, and now that here we are entertaining the vultures with nothing to show for it? Not nothing. I resent all my accomplishments to, d to date being called nothing, you know? Come on. Three barns ain't so far. What should we do when we get there? Collapse, probably. Not me. I'm not old. I mean, us normal people, old hag. After that, after that, who knows? I'm sure we'll come up with something. Come. What the fuck was that? I don't know what that is. Ten years of peace follow. What happens on those ten years of peace, Colin? Darloff, re Darloff retires. That's one of them. Is Darloff's gonna fucking retire? Dan's little cracky latch shapely and grew large. Plus one uh, of every resource? What the fuck? Dan? Ring a uh, kiss from near and far. Eventually, he researches the wild. It soared free, roaming the rocks and hills and spent time con communing with the tortoise in her shared dream. Okay, that's it? That's all she did? <laughs> she liked it, the turtle. <laughs> when cloaked in ivy, spirit lay out three futures for Eerie to pick from. After much negotiation, one was finally picked. Timothy has acquired a family of cats for a few seasons. <laughs> of course, you, you fucking loser. <laughs> and watch them stalk birds in the morning with an uneasy sense of kinship. When Mozilla came uh, uh, came with a case of a wild bar fever, Darloff would come by to clean the place and handle uh, handle a soup pot. You're not putting whiskey <laughs> in there again. Why does everyone think I'm a fucking drunk? <laughs> Dan tried to take Timothy shopping at the local outfitters. Like Plus, he was. <laughs> Wait, you you do, Dan? That's that's right. Plus, they give the Fellowship of the Silent Song a great discount. But I like the clothes I have. You smell. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I wash it. Everyone said it wouldn't last, but now that your retirement would wear off, and Darloff would grow bored of fine wine and afternoon naps by the lake. Darloff proved them all wrong. <laughs> Well, if has retired, he's no longer in your party, but he'll be in your legacy and may play a part in the future stories. Oh, interesting. Timothy, the Q Daniel's son, has reached it. What? <laughs> he's got a son? I have a son? Why is everyone having kids just in secret? Also, why is he so beautiful? <laughs> he's kind of a man, isn't he? He's got the same hair! Broad swipes, dude. <sighs> um, untouchable is pretty cool, actually. That's too, that's good too. I right, let's do broad swipes. That one's kind of I just like swipes. broad swipes is just kind of a fucking Chad thundercock ability. Yeah. What is going on? Wait, wait. Do you see this? The, I'm not seeing it, but the during the years of peace screen is just like not advancing. Oh, he's got to train a rookie. What? I forgot. When you got a retire, when you have a retiree. Who is he training? He's gonna train Jimothy's kid. He's gonna be the real dad. Ooh, all right, okay. If he'll let me pick. I saw it pop up for just one moment. Okay, there we go. Wait, what? Oh, it stopped for a moment. You're gonna, you're gonna have to fucking quick draw this. Just have to impart his wisdom too. Well, I'm glad Jimothy raised a warrior because if he were kind of down one all of a sudden. Yeah. Oh my. God, this fucking game. Come on. Come on, I want to go to bed. I want to go to bed. There we go. It's what? Level two already. Upgrade uh. broad swipes. Uh. <laughs> Upgrade oh, broad but, swipes. But wait, you don't. But what about blood rage, though? What about blood rage, though? Oh, fine. 
<laughs> oh my god. Do you want god. even more? He wasn't even using the sword. Yeah, honestly, he wasn't. And he just upgrades the fire blast. Yes. <laughs> I'll steal it. <laughs> Fucking stupid Dan backslides mace. Oh, Cadis. Oh. Yuri. Oh god, you're old! Everyone's old. Jesus Christ, Zinbird Tumblespake, Giga Chan at L23. <laughs> what, what is his name? Because it's not Zinbird Tumblespake. We can't allow this, right? He's the son of Jimothy the Q, the Q Daniel. <laughs> it's... We have to give him two almost names also, right? <laughs> yeah, we, do, we have to give him two almost names. Uh, let's combine some names. Um, uh. I'm thinking like Zachary. What if it's like. What if it's like Zachary and like Jebediah? Zachadiah? Zachadiah or like Jebbery? <laughs> I think Zachadiah is pretty good. Okay, alright. I like that. Zachadiah. The Junior. <laughs> Zach Zachadiah the Junior. Daniel. How do you spell that? <laughs> <laughs> Z A C H or C K, however I, you want it. I think Z. I think C H. Zach. All right. Uh, e D I A H. Zachadiah. Zachadiah the Junior. Thought Jimothy would have raised a fucking Giga Chad. Yeah, right. <laughs> Mama didn't raise no bitch, I guess. Oh god, what if he god, what if he like what if he wished uh Darloff was his was his dad so he has his hair? He has he has Darloff's hair. Yeah, why not? Uh, he, he he styles his hair to like Darloff's because he wishes Darloff was his dad. Yeah, do it, why not? <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see here. Customize. Hidden face. Where's which was the hairstyle? <laughs> we gotta, you gotta give him like a beard, right? He's, he... <laughs> yeah, I like it. I think. Hear me out. I think we give him... He, gets a, a, he starts with a tier 2 spear? I was gonna say, what if we go fucking psychotic and give him a tier 3 fire spear? Like a fire great spear? Yeah. <coughs> Fuck me, dude. Alright. Alright. Because cause, cause honestly, we're doing pretty good. I think we can afford to get really funny with it. Alright. Alright, let's do it then. What's it going to be called? The fuck. <laughs> the fuck. Junior. The, the fuck. Description. It fucks. <laughs> it fucks. Why isn't it letting me type? 
fuck? I can't type it or whatever. The fuck? Alright, what about everyone else? I don't know, man. Everyone seems like mostly fine. <laughs> we could give Mazala the, uh... Nah, I don't know. It doesn't give that much. Uh, well, we could give her Heather Drab, which would give her two armor, one warding, and spell one spell damage. damage. I don't, I don't mind that, yeah. Sure, let's do it. But you... Your butt's all better. What about Dan? We can give Dan a real-ass bow. We give him, like, a whole-ass bow? Yeah, I think so. I think he has earned it. Give him a tier 2 bow? Yeah. He's graduating. Stone bow or, stone bow or a regular let's one? Let's do a regular bow, just in case he comes across, like, a leaf spirit or something. So then okay. we can start unlocking more shit. Uh, what's this bow called? Dora. Dor Doris. Stand. Pipe. Doris. Doris. Stand. stand. Pipe. Okay, what the fuck? Okay, Doris. I hit A, and it deletes the whole ass thing. D Doris. Okay. Fine. It's just a, a powerful bow. How he loved her. <laughs> How he loved her. <laughs> um. If nothing else, we could give Cadis better armor. I'm fine with that. We have a lot of, like, materials. Like, ingots and and such, so. Damn, everyone's kind of looking pretty fucking kitted, gotta say. Yeah. What the fuck did Jimothy have a kid with to make a fucking beautiful jeaned child like that? <laughs> I think I think that's everything Technically we could give like Dan a knife if we wanted to or like a tier 3 mace but I don't, th I don't think we need to bother <laughs> Give me Dan a tier 3 mace I think it's fine the way it is I think it's fine <laughs> I think it's fine Next Oh, okay, it skipped it for me. Welp. Where are we supposed to go? Oh my god, okay. Alright, we, we, we have to we have to save. We we you we, can't we have to, we, we have to stop here. Save. There's a new recruit opportunity right there. Oh we can replace that other guy who left. What was his name again? Anyway. Robin. <laughs> <Come on. laughs> Zakadai is named in save, so he's just a nameless warrior. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll rename him next next stream. <laughs> oh fuck me, that's funny. <laughs> what do they call you? What? <laughs> 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 Who's calling me what? No, Zachariah, that's your name. That's no. What'd you call me? He just fucking impales his dad. <laughs> just God. Well, Jimothy, it's up to you to lead these, lead, lead these sorry sacks before you were usurped by your master not, race child. Not, not even Cadis. <laughs> well, I mean, Jimothy's higher level. Yeah, all right. You want to give it to Dan? Mm, nah. Yeah, no. actually, well, <laughs> hey, he's earned it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give me that badge, mate. Give, give me that. Give me that authority. Yeah. Your Jim. Give it to Dan. Yeah. But, 
but that doesn't make sense. Give it over. Give it go. Come on. Come on. Oh, good. So we got this whole ass plot of land. There's like two more chapters to do, right? Yeah, the chapter four. We have one more chapter after this one. Save and quit. I'm out of here. Yeah, I'm done. Save. This sucks. <laughs> Fuck me. Uh, well, thanks for uh, thanks for playing game with me, Colin. I uh, I had a good time. This game's funny. I, I had a good time forgetting what um, Daisuke Jigen's name was. <laughs> <laughs> next, okay, remind me next adventure. I'm making Tommy Wiseau the warrior. Okay, gotcha. This is you know what I just realized. Yeah. This is like Tamadachi Life RPG edition. <laughs> yeah, it is. People just get married, people randomly have kids. <laughs> you suddenly have to take care of the kids. You know, you, you take it a little bit seriously at first, and then you're like, oh, fuck. I, I'm just going to put Dan Backside, Tommy Wiseau, fucking the Michelin Man. Uh, just put everyone in this fucking game. <laughs> Imagine being able to start someone off with a transformation so I can make Tommy Wiseau a vampire off the bat. Or like a fucking bird. <laughs> or a crow, yeah. Oh, Christ. Oh, that... fuck, we can still recruit, like, Orin and, like, that stuff like that. Yeah, because, you know, even though they're close to retirement age, that doesn't mean that we can't get them back, you know? Right. Oh, God, people are gonna transform... I, I really want to see Jimothy. Jimothy's uh, like really growing. I want to see. I want to see Jimothy turn into a being of fucking pure fire. I think he might because we got that like first chapter, didn't we? Uh, well, I think we got it second. <laughs> we might see. We might see a full transformation, maybe. Maybe. Anyways, uh, uh, tonight stream. Uh, tonight. Uh, I'll catch everyone later. I'd like to wrap up this Wildermyth uh, campaign before I leave. Uh, and then maybe do do something else. I don't know what. We'll figure it out. All right. Uh, but Janite stream and uh, Janite Colin. Janite.